Welcome to the OSR's podcast where we talk about RuneScape related news, updates, and all sorts of stuff. This is going to be the first podcast of 2019, and we're going to be starting this year off hopefully really well. we got a lot of plans in store for you, especially this video. And uh, remember to like, subscribe, tell your friends, long-ass video. Go ahead and enjoy. I'm one of your hosts, Mint Mad Cow, joined by the people down below. It's me, Rice Cup. What the fuck was that? (laughs) (laughs) What's going on, guys? Rakesy here. And uh, today we're joined by a good friend of mine, our guest, Framed. How's it going, man? Hey. (laughs) (laughs) It's a good intro. I like it, dude. I like it. Oh, yeah. Cheers for coming on, man. We appreciate that. How you doing? Of course. Good, man. Happy to be here. Just uh, a little disoriented right now because there's this guy um, who just killed me the other day, and I just found out that he's back in World uh, 343. Oh, no, not again. Big boy risk. Oh, God. Yeah, so that's why I'm, I'm sitting here instead of doing that instead, but that just... Some more glories. Track, Some more glories, dude. <laughs> no, no, not that guy. Not that oh, guy. oh. Guy, yeah. I get more excited hey, for that guy, to be honest. That guy you, has you want a... to log in and go for him, go no, for him. No, 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 no. Dude. It's all good. I'm, I'm here. Let's get I'm some here. sneak peeks to the next vid, bro. Come on. Um, <laughs> yeah. I'm here, man. Now, since Frame's latest video, he took advantage of the maintenance. Dude, that was brilliant, by the way. Uh, just to explain, you want to explain your video where you uh, went into the PvP worlds without protect item? Because that, that, my friend, was a brilliant idea for this maintenance. Um. Well... I got the idea when I, w- I was literally just sitting there gearing up for Demonic Gorillas on my Zerker account, you know, the one I do from scratch. And I go to hop to another world because it was just too packed there. And I saw that there was no world 24. And I was like, what? That's weird. And because I have, um, I have it in my bottom two like favorite worlds... I saw it said unavailable, and I knew that was World 24, and then I saw World 43 had that many people. I was like, wait a minute, that's weird. So I went uh, and checked that world, and I saw all these people running around with their one item, uh, like their protect item thing, like what they would use to protect the item, yeah. their plus ones. Why couldn't I think of the word plus one? Uh, and <laughs> I figured, there's no way they don't realize this, right? So one of the first people I kill... Uh, I got his light ballista, and I was like, okay. And then I saw the guy later. He's like, what the fuck? I didn't know it was uh, a non plus one. I was like, you gotta be kidding me. There's no way you didn't know that. So then I PK'd someone else. And I got a heavy ballista. I didn't see that guy again, but I started to kind of figure out well, both of those guys were smiting, and, you know, that's what you do in the plus one world. Not, not a non plus one world. There's pretty much no point to smite other than to train their stats, but people really don't get their stats drained anyway. So, yeah. There's there's not much of a point to smite in a non plus one world. No, but not really. Regardless, regardless, <laughs> I got those two plus one items, and then I figured, okay, I, I want to know how many people I can get for their plus ones. So I kept doing it, kept doing it, and well, I don't know if I, I I won't necessarily ruin the video, but I it, it's kind of surprising how many people didn't realize that, especially the one enemies. That's it. Like they just didn't realize that because World Twenty Four wasn't there, it doesn't mean that they just moved it to World Forty Three, the world that's always been there. Dude. You know what I mean? It, it's just I don't know. I, I, I just I don't know. I feel I don't, wait, I don't, I don't get it. What? Well, what did they do exactly? They changed the non-protection worlds. No, they didn't change it. It was just down. For yeah, they were down for maintenance. Most of the servers were gone, and then the rest of the yeah, U.S. servers oh, were day. super yeah. laggy that day. Could barely PK. Oh, but this yeah, man's yeah, over here collecting plus a, ones like a beast. It, it was garbage. It was completely garbage. And oh. the uh, the other way that like I even realized that they were doing maintenance because I don't go to the old school website every day. You know no, I mean? no, me there's, either. There's no point. Uh, I realized when I signed into the one account i have my world defaulted to world 57 and it put me in like a random world i didn't notice that at first again until i went to go hop because it was just a crowded world i don't even remember which world i was in but like it was way too crowded and then another like i I loaded up another account i don't even remember what i was gonna do but that didn't put me in world 57 either so i realized oh i guess they're doing maintenance and then i went to go check and again who checks the fucking website didn't know up until that point (laughs) So, dude, when I saw the AGS guy, man, oh my god, I'm thinking, 
there's no way. There's no way this man's going to skull the AGS one prayer pot in his inventory. It must be on RuneScape Mobile or something, you know? Dude, I, I don't even know what the fuck people are doing. That's Okay, so the, like, like the, dumbest thing. the maintenance, you know, that stuff doesn't happen often. I guess they just, yeah. like, probably just didn't think about it at all. Ah, uh, I guess. not, because yeah. I, I, think that, I think that's only ever happened one other time. But, like, I don't think it was for the whole day. I think it was... It was just, 12 hours. It was 12 hours last time? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I didn't even, like, think to do it last time either, you know what I mean? Like, I just didn't yeah. cross it. I mean, now you can do it any other time it happens. Yo, yeah. I'll be making yeah, a video on that too, again. man. Oh, oh, man. <laughs> it was such a good idea. Good. Now, if that ever happens again, you're probably thinking, well, this was a great way to get this video out. Do you have any other plans that you want to share with us if that ever happens? Or did you not think that far ahead? Because there's some good content to be had. On the... what, when that happens? Yeah, yeah, before it just well, takes it, out some it, of these the, worlds. The initial plan was to go for all of the rushers because they normally have a good plus one, mm -hmm. but I really couldn't find that many rushers. Like, they, they, they were still here and there, but of course, this, this always seems to happen to me for whatever reason. I signed off the, you know, I, I logged off the my rusher account, my level 71, and then I go on to my Zerker to go PK people like that. And, of course, I start seeing all the rushers again, like, maybe 20 minutes later that were in that uh, lower combat bracket for my peer. So I figured, I can go kill them now. I'll log off and go kill them. No, I log back in and they're gone. I don't get it. It's like some really weird voodoo shit where if I'm on that account, they are not <laughs> going to be logged into that world or something. I mean, if it's only one world, man, it's probably easy to scout your ass out, huh? Yeah, they're like, oh, it's framed. Yeah. It's I don't I want to be on a video, I, I dude. People, no, I doubt people are thinking that much into it. I don't even think they notice me because I'm normally like under like name staff. change or something. Well, no, no, I, I don't like the name change too much. Like if I have a good name, like I'll name change for videos or like skull tricking or something, you know, yeah. just to do like some like bad boy shit. But like <laughs> bad boy yeah. shit. You know yeah. who changes his name every video? Chunk, dude. Chunk. Chunk. Yeah. Wait, yeah. does he? Oh yeah, he does. Every actually. video, because he was actually peak. Like I was at Rev Cave the other night on stream, and he was uh, somehow helping me in multi. I didn't even know it was him. And they pick up an AGS. I'm like, that's funny. You got AGS off a of ragger. Wake up the next day, it's fucking chunk. I'm like, God. And you didn't split, you piece of shit. I was out there, man. Come on, bro. But Damn, dude. every He's video, to your mate is well. right. Where's the split, dude? Oh, uh, people don't fucking get it though. Like. Chunk, because obviously I like Chunk, but Chunk's not the best PK. Like, it's, it's kind of obvious. Nope. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Ooh. No, dude. no, I wish I could show <laughs> you this clip. Let's be real with it. Kevin, well, well, yeah. he like, came over to my house. It? No, no, he came over to my house when I was in Cali. And he uh, uses uh, the mouse F keys on his thumb, right? So I hooked yeah. him up with my keyboard. I don't, I don't got no big ass thumbs and shit. So I got to use the real F keys. And this man couldn't hit one prayer right. And he <laughs> I did like two <laughs> seconds to a ragger. And I'm sitting there, half of us, like, oh man. I wish I had the clip to show you. It's, you cannot oh, PK man. a fat so mouse. Regardless, yeah. Dude, regardless. I still watch his videos. I think he's entertaining. Oh yeah, very. And the amount of The amount of plus ones. That he gets off of people is ridiculous. Like obviously he has like clips where like he red bars people or you know fist fights or whatever. Mm -hmm. But like the amount of plus ones he's actually gotten off of people, I think I've seen him get like two or three pairs of claws and like six AGSs or something like that. Just like a ridiculous amount of plus ones. People don't realize that there's so many noobs out there that just don't. It must be the time zone EPK is in because it, it must be. Or I'm something. missing all of this loot every time I go to man. I'm always piled so. I, I imagine it's a mixture of a few things, like, because RuneScape Mobile's come out, it's probably brought back a lot of new players and, like, old players, yeah. so there What's are a like lot that? more clueless people in the wilderness nowadays than there were, like, a couple months ago. Like, it is yeah. popping. Like, it really is. Yeah, well, dude, again, if, if you put enough hours into PKing and you go to places that aren't, like, just so frequented by, like, clans and everything, you're eventually going to find these big loots because if you watch clan pk videos at all they run into this crap all the time they always run into the newbie plus ones because they have so many people out there like in what, like 30, yeah like 30 different people that are all just sitting there baiting waiting to call their entire team in like it happens a lot of the times where there's just newbie b cares that's what <clears throat> excuse me that's why i normally try to go out of my way and change up what i'm doing because you can find more noobs in different areas like you, you just pretty much have to look 
And I wanted to show you my uh, Twitch clip that I found. I found this guy um, in full full dragon whip level like 70 scold with a fury, oh and uh, oh. it was at a green dragon. So I'm thinking, ah, he's probably skull bot and whatever. No, this man was PKing, dude. He must have just got a bogola. <laughs> he was PKing. <laughs> And it is the OB shield, and uh, I'm like, oh shit, he must just have one melee, no range. Well, halfway through the fight, he tries to water blast me, and I'm thinking, this man's a tribrid. <laughs> I, gotta, I gotta go, dude. He's gonna take me out. Oh, man. He was trying to entangle me and shit in full dragon. Dude, it's. Dude, I, I gotta see that. I, His mama trained I don't know well. if I can find it, man. <laughs> it's on one of my videos. Um. Oh my yeah, I'm not sure I well, can find it. Right? Oh yeah, of course, of course. I, I PK yeah. two sets of dragon that night. It was a dude, weird two night. Two sets. Two of dragon sets of dragon. Yeah, man. it's it's weird, dude. When it rains, oh it pours God. for that shit. You know. <laughs> it, 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 it's you got like all that. these beautiful country sayings for all these PK and slogans, man. I love it. I'm not. I'm not thinking about it like that, but I guess. <laughs> Well, I don't, I don't bust out no country shit when I PK full dragon, but I'm about to now, you know. That's how no, it goes. No, yeah, I, I can't. The it's somewhere. Full bandos, <clears throat> oh yeah, nah, the that full bandos bot skull or whatever that was with yeah, the abyssal dagger. I remember that. That I was remember that was. Dude, I remember back in the day, if you PK'd full dragon, like holy shit, that was like the biggest PK you could get aside from like a rare. Dude, and like, yeah. and a whip it, it on the nuts. floor too. Oh. 20 mil yeah, beat chain like PK. Whips oh back in the day Oof. were like, you PK'd one, like, holy shit. When they first came out, they were like 30 mil or something. Like, oh, on dude. release. It's that insane. Is. You know what annoys me that... on seasonal dead memo? People PK whips, and it's nothing now because of VLSs. Yeah. I'm like, that's yeah, a whip dude. PK, and no one gives a shit. Wait, yo, so they're keeping that for like throughout the. I guess. Like, I would. Most likely. It's fun to watch, but I wouldn't want to like just you know be running along and with my blue D hide and take a fifty to the dome day four, you know. <laughs> yeah. Well, dude, I, I'm tired of dead men mode. <laughs> yeah, this, this is I, the one. This is the one thing I think would make it better, is if they made it every six months. Like at the very least, have something for the other yeah, you know, two cause slots. Right now, because, right now it's quarterly. Yeah, man. Yeah, it's, I, it's, I, it's I think it's a bit too fat too often. Yeah. I saw a lot of streamers and stuff on Twitter were saying that they weren't going to take part in the new demo mode tournament. Like some streamers that take part every single time and they're not going to do it. And like, I was speaking to Mika the other night, and he was like, "Don't forget to qualify your demo mode seasonal account." And I was like, "Fuck that." Yeah, Mika's like, not going to forget. Can't be I mean, <laughs> Mika, you know, he's he's like a star. Do. He's a star uh, demo yeah. mode. Of, dude, oh, yeah. he no, goes in, he man. I, I can a, respect there, there's some his. Some people that like will always do that stuff because it always does well for them, and they yeah, always that's make good content. content. Yeah, yeah. they that's they make good concept. content from it too. So like, it, I mean, if someone does enjoy it, doesn't enjoy it, they shouldn't do it. You know, I haven't been doing it for a little bit now. It's been... You can't even tax at the pyramids on stream, dude. You get sniped, naked DDS running around. The tears, man. I miss those days. I just, I just feel for, like, the amount of effort that you put into it, you dude. get very little out. Like, yeah, yeah we, we can I, upload I a video every yeah. single day, but you're you're training, like... It, if you're not training 12 hours a day in the tournament, you're doing it wrong. You're not going to be able to compete in the final. And then, like, you spent all that time... 12 hours isn't very much to compete per day in Dumbo Mood tournament. That's a mm -hmm. lot of time, and then you get to the final hour, and you just you gotta lick someone's ass to get inside of a clan, and then you want to join my clan. Anyways, <laughs> it's like that, what what is the point? I I, I don't know. I, for me, demo mode, I don't really want to play anymore. I've I've, I've, I've stopped lost, watching. Like, fun. It's not fun. I've stopped no. watching people who put like you know training clips in their dead man videos, you know, because like I just want to see well, PKing at this point. I'm the, seven seasons in. I'm like. <laughs> I'm out. Yeah. Oh. That's training, literally that's, that's, that's what it is. sick. Yeah. I'll be honest. Wow, 10k in the beginning, never saw that coming, you know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's new. Yo, like the only thing I watch about them MMO, not gonna lie, it's just the finals. That's it. I don't watch anything else. Like I, no YouTube videos. It, no it got to the like, point, dude. I haven't even watched the past two finals. I don't even care anymore. Oh, someone fucking <sighs> won. Cool. Anyone we know? No? Okay, whatever. <laughs> yeah, no, because, like, literally, I'm just waiting. So, did Mika finally win? What's up? I just got to pay attention to Mika's fights. I pick on him a lot, so I got to... You know, I gotta know what he loses to. When he lost to Mammal, Mika's man, good, dude. Mika's, Mika's a beast, good. and Mammal was a beast, but I still had to give him yeah. shit, you know? It's yeah, like everyone gave him shit. Know, yeah, dude. It, it doesn't matter if Mammal became the best PK there. He's still gotta give anyone shit that dies to him. I, and I just gotta say, man, <clears throat> Mammal, 
bravo, dude. Fucking bravo. You just took out yeah, a man who played I, like a hundred hours on seasonal. Like, <laughs> you know what it is? He had more. He had more uh, confidence at, on yeah. stage versus Mika. Yeah, oh, yeah dude. Uh, listen, you guys are forgetting someone important. Fucking Rixie comes in ten hey. hours. Of oh hours yeah, like that. <laughs> dude, it was five hours, up. man. Five hours. Ten. Yes, everyone. You want to see me on 10 hours of practice, mate? I would have taken yeah. first place. Oh, man, I'd yeah, love to see that, know. man. I would have loved to Bro, see I'm, that. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not proud of you anymore. <laughs> you, <laughs> you did not like is, your compliment. Understand you took that. Like, you just understand shredded it. Understand this, right? Every single person that played in the All-Stars, aside from me, knew that they were playing in it three months in advance, at least three months in advance. So everyone was practicing, like, what, well, I don't know, at least six hours a day for it. I literally got told on the Monday... And then I was going there on like Wednesday or Thursday. And in those days, I was only able to get on the computer for five hours. And I haven't PK'd like in the longest fucking time. So I loved it though, man. Everyone, yeah. I feel like everybody like, um, what's the word? They underestimated me like big time and it bit them in the ass. Yeah. Like, it was so much fun. That's the cloak you had to underestimate. Oh, Gracie, Mac Theater. That was so isn't good. Isn't he the, the <laughs> one week challenge guy that does thing, you know? Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. But if you can do a that... week of PVM, I'd be scared yeah. too, to be honest. Damn, that's some the resolve. The thing that people don't know is that obviously I PK'd for like 10 fucking years. I was like a king of Mage Bank. That's all I did. My childhood was just Mage Bank PK, and that was it. So, oh, yeah, that, was, that involved a lot of tribe. By the way, what happened to Mage Bank PK? Because I never got to <laughs> live through that. <laughs> I would love to bring it back, you know. I I don't really know. It's the same with like what whatever. Well, you know, it wouldn't make sense whatever happened to Falador Park trading because there's the Grand Exchange. Yeah. But it just it's not a convenient place to have fights. I guess people just got lazy. It's like what's the point in going all the way to Mage Bank when you can just yeah, have it in Edgeville? Yeah, I think people just hop people on you was. if you That's were about to die with TB. But yeah, I like know, people I love like Mage Bank. in the convenience like that. Yeah. But it's deep worldly, there's something it. beautiful about the deep worldy, though, man. I mean, um, I saw yeah. Chunk make a video, and I keep bringing up Chunk for some reason, uh, about Mog Time stream where he made everyone bring out 2006 gear, and they all went to Mage Bank, and that made me feel really nostalgic. And I'm not even sure if they could even try to code in this, but it would be nice if we had like a 2006 only world where like Arums is like top class gear and a DDS is primally beast. Dude, that'd, that'd be, be cool. so much fun. Yeah, that'd be that'd, I would that'd always be, be on that world, right? Uh, but now, like cool. honestly you know what it is though they you probably don't want to divide like the p cares too much anymore yeah you, that's you feel that that so it, why that's don't they to look why don't it. why don't they do it like oh like a event thing just like once that would be week, cool anything you know, would be cool yeah. as long as they touch on the fact that yeah because like, like keep the world the same you much. know people can't fully hp because of ags's d claws but if you have a world where it's dds's you might see really risky close edgy fights and it'd be Probably something that bring a lot of people back into it, you know. No one, I've never seen someone watch like a dead man mode, like actually, you know, the PKing on World 345 and go, Yeah, I would love to train for weeks and then try to get a full stack on somebody with AGS G Mall and a bank stand, yeah, no, you know. It's fucking boring. <laughs> it's it's so boring. boring. No, no one wants to PK. I people mean, want it's like, been done. Yeah, it's been, it's like the norm now, right? People want that yeah. exciting fight, you know. Oh, I would love to go out there and slap some cheeks at Mage Bank and Arams. Oh, man. <laughs> That'd be sweet. I mean, yeah, you can. I mean, they, it's just it's kind of dead. You know, that's yeah. the only issue. Like, it's yeah. kind of dead. You gotta host it. <laughs> when you find when you host, you get stream sniped. There's gonna be a clan yeah. coming for you. Mm -hmm. like, yeah. that, that's gonna be Mage Bank. In they got like a little I mean, police radio or people having fun. Fucking hit it. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> the, last time, <laughs> the last time I saw anything like Mage Bank PK related was like Spartman's videos <clears throat> when he hosted them. Like, I don't. It was a while ago. It was, you know, years back now. But it was still in old school. He hosted those. It was actually interesting to watch. It was just Derok, you know, basically Derek switch and kill. Yeah. All the lower level as soon as I DH bombed <laughs> on stream much. for the first yeah, time on good. Twitch, I, I he like started doing it. That, yeah. Yeah. Like oh. he'd be going like a six kill streak with with one invent. I'm like, oh shit. Yeah. It was actually. Dude, it was the the content. Yeah. That was that was some <laughs> prime content. Dude, I I think that they would really benefit from uh, from. Um. Oh man. From like uh, getting rid of dead men mode for those two months though like you know, oh yeah I'm, sure. I'm tired of these like and it's like every time yeah, if yeah. you're not doing dead men mode content you're irrelevant for like a week like yeah dude i, I hate I'm it fucking i'm irrelevant for the uh for a week you know right I mean? like, yeah everyone is i don't blame you for not making dead videos like fuck it's so much effort 
and the little reward, very little reward, and you got to deal with all these people who and have it's, it's insane reward. strategies. It's crazy. It's, it's a reward enough for me because, you know, like, obviously, you know, being a YouTuber and everything, I'll get, I'll get the views from it. Like, everyone gets views from it, but, like, it's it's not fun. It's just not yeah. fun anymore. And, like, it's why force stressful, yourself? You know? yeah. yeah. Why force yourself to do something you don't enjoy? Yeah, man. Fuck it. Just go on vacation for the week. Like, yeah, just chill. You, you gotta be, well, that's pretty much what I did. Like, I, I oh. in, a, in a sense, I, I recorded other videos during that week. Like, yeah, but I, I you didn't upload them because you knew people wouldn't be interested because demo yeah. mode was going Next on. Next demo mode, Kevin, exactly. bro. Let's go to Vegas. All right, let's fly down. Yeah. Hotel, dude. <laughs> be, to hey, be honest, though, if enough streamers and influencers aren't playing demo mode, like, Jagex, they need to do something. They'll stop. You know what I mean? Yeah, like right now, it's like the the views doesn't seem to decline. So there's no way they're stopping now. For it's, them, it's it's all about marketing. This is the e one of the easiest advertising uh, stunts that exactly. They can do. Yeah. And it's cheap. Yeah. It's not even that yeah, expensive. Yeah, very it's very cheap. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the it's, more dude, expensive people, part people is setting it up. Money, yeah, people think the thirty thousand dollars is like a lot of money. Oh, nah, but the oh, but the exposure that, that you get from hosting this every yeah. uh, quarter of the year is. It's a I, lot. I guess, a lot yeah. And that's why I'm not like 100% against it, but for older content creators who want to deal with that shit, you'll just get instantly replaced that week by all these yeah. people who have the oh, energy, yeah. haven't making videos for like four years, and you're thinking, damn it, I'm old. You know, fuck, I don't want to do this again. I, I, think, I think if uh, content creators wanted Dead Man Mode to actually be something really good, they should just take off uh, one of the Dead Man Modes every single time. Like, if Bodhi, Torvesta, obviously, you know, Curtis and Mank and everyone, all of them took off that memo, which they wouldn't. Like, no. It's understandable. Yeah. Because they get too much money from it. And, like, yeah. you can't really blame them. Then that would kind of force Jagex's hand to do something different. <laughs> I you would just I mean? like Basically, to see it slightly more uh, yeah. friendly, right? For just like the beginning phase instead of Mage well, Bow PK and stuff, you know? Like, actually, I like the Mage Bow PK, but like, by the way, day three, Morgan's Javelins, no one wants to PK <laughs> if you don't have yeah. one of those items. It's, yeah, it's <laughs> it's just so unfun. Like, the overall idea that I had for Dead Man mode is just make it so I can go and kill literally anything. Obviously, the higher NPC, high, higher combat NPC, the better. I can kill anything, and in five, six hours, I can be PK ready because I killed the same thing, and I got, like, Mystics drops every now and then. They're, like, Dragon Daggers. I'd say, like, something. two just, hours, man, just PK yeah, ready. Just, just, just fucking, some stupid bullshit yeah. that I can kill. Yeah, I'm saying, like, even I can kill goblins for six hours or something, and I can be PK ready. Yeah. So, so <clears throat> people would get, like, those big loots, you know, like, Mystics and stuff, yeah. and it's not really yeah. worth much, but it's just a fun PK server where there's yeah, no stress. So yeah, so the real question is, is that, because, like, you know, Devon Mode kind of built up, at like, a building, right? Like, building up to being able to do stuff. Should they get rid of, like, the building process? Building, like, out? Fortnite? In, in which sense? Mm, like, you know, getting the stats. <laughs> <and> getting the <laughs> right. Right. That's I mean, a building, dude. Let's that. go. They need that um, over time, but, like, should it be, like, almost, almost you know... It, it, it should be, I think, one season would benefit from being completely reworked like the entire yeah. idea of the season is completely reworked where you just get stuff like you know, like, like okay i can start with like this really basic shit and it takes me two hours to get all of my stats up and to get some gear to start being pk ready yeah you know what i mean like like to where i can go and kill like literally anyone um and get loot and they have no problem with going and kicking cows for three hours because they'll get some loot back from it do, do you remember when uh dead man just started and they were so picky with it they didn't even want to change the xp rates from five times uh xp an hour it's because they had so many people out there and now they don't so they, they're like yeah. we gotta change this shit they're, fast they're doing, they're doing anything <laughs> to keep the game mode alive but like here's the thing they don't care about the game mode and I'm not saying the individual J mods uh, don't care about the game mode. I'm saying Jagex as a whole does not care about the game mode. They because... want it more as marketing. So yeah, it, it's it's a marketing stunt. <laughs> it's not actually a fun game mode where they care about where like they actually want the development of that game mode to progress. Yeah, because what what good. what seems to be going on is that like they're changing it slightly every time, ever so slightly. But... Yeah. But like the core of it is just you spend however many hours to build up, but it sucks for most people because most of them are gonna die and lose all that. <clears throat> and so it's like, you know, majority yeah. of people are not gonna 
by the, by the end of it, they're not they're not gonna be too happy. And I think I, they, remember, oh, I heard a I heard a suggestion ages ago, and it was somebody basically saying it might be Manked who said uh, if they were to transfer the stats from seasonal over to tournament, that would solve a fair few issues. Now I don't think it would solve like demo mode as a whole, but yeah. I think like it. It could it help would. in a it, sense. It would, you know? it would, but they already just gave the same excuse of it's not possible. But I mean, I, I'm, I'm really doubting Engine when they work. say it's not possible. <laughs> like, I, I really doubt they have it. Attorney World, it's where changing engine. stats is possible. So there's no way no, that's no, not, not possible. No, not that, right? but oh. to take it from the high scores, they said it's not possible. I oh, think that on. it is. I, I think just about anything is possible. There's some brilliant guy. J mods on yeah, there. That's a out. dumb excuse. You know when they I mean? say impossible, most of the time improbable. it just means we don't have the people. <laughs> we to don't want to do it. Like we we, do we don't have the resources, yeah, yeah. and we yeah. don't want to. Because like the they're doing something else that's more priority. But I'm... Uh, yeah, exactly. I, I don't I don't really believe them at this point. Like I, I used to buy the idea. Oh, okay, they, they can't yeah. do it. No problem. It's, I don't believe it a, anymore. It's just to end the discussion quick. You know, what I mean, they're not. Yeah, they don't want to exactly. go in depth, and it's like I don't got time for this. So now, impossible. yeah, talking hey, about J mods. Oh, sorry. Go for it again. No, no, it's okay. Oh, I was about to go into talking about J mods and how they're trying to talk about new updates. Group Iron Man was not brought into the game yet because of a CC bug or whatever. Like, they couldn't get around the CC coding. And lately, uh, clan chats have been bugging out. So, oh, I don't yeah. know if they've released anything, but I think they're working on Group Iron Man. I, th I think I mean, they are too. Well, like they're working the on thing. engine related stuff, which could I'll, I'll put it like this. I'll put it like this. This is the way I see them doing this, and obviously you guys are all YouTubers, so you can relate. So you know when you have your good videos, you know, like your your really good ones, like you put a lot of effort into it, and like people are gonna yeah, like the super that, right? Yeah, ones. Yeah, yeah, it, <laughs> yeah <they're, laughs> like, your good ones. But you know, <clears throat> you have that crap. But then every now and then, because you're a YouTuber, you need to consistently make videos. You have an idea that you know people will like, but you know it's not as high quality as other ideas. It's like super simple. Yeah. You know what I mean? But yep. like, it's still gonna be a good video, whatever. Yeah. I think that's what group Iron Man mode is for them. They were just waiting for when they don't have any new content to release new content. You know what I mean? I, I don't blame them. Spreading yeah, it out is the best either. way. Yeah, because like, here's here's what what's going on this year, right? They have a lot of uh promising stuff coming out this year so it doesn't really like it probably isn't as important for them to work on now they yeah. have so much to do. i'm not no, i don't want them to rush it either there's so much shit i no, want to no, do they, they shouldn't rush well. it. I, yeah. I have no problem yeah. with it i just think that's the ideology they're going with and that's, that's yeah. a good ideology because dude let's be real like as youtubers every now and then we kind of need those filler videos anyway like obviously you, yeah. always, you always still make a quality but like it, it just has to happen. Like that. That's normally what when series come into play as well, where it's yeah, like from like, scratch. Yeah. To me, I think of Group Iron Man. Uh, oh, Group Iron Man. Like it's really co-op mode, really. I yeah. think of it more as like you know mid-tier content in terms of quality because it's it's not like you're actually playing an Iron Man, right? Because like the only thing that sells is the fact that you can you can group up with people and as a creator from a creator's point of view, you can group up with maybe other creators and do some like marketing stunt with it, right? It's yeah. Oh day, yeah, right? dude. We're gonna sell merch every That's day, bro. Like it is, right? It'll be a bit fun because you're like, oh, I haven't played with you know, and I haven't played with like a friend like that in RuneScape before. Spend a long time, whatever. Like that's kind of like the the perspective. Man. But at the end of the day, though, it's like not that much. It's not very really hard because you have people to you know do stuff. So. Well, I just wanted them to kind of come out and say that they're working on it because the CC glitch has cost me a couple smites. You know, I'll, I'll be on a world like oh, I see yeah, somebody no. they don't like. Oh, we can't find your world, and they're gone already. Yeah, they get. Oh, uh, I, I was actually watching Amenity last night, and he kept getting kicked out of his CC. Oh yeah, man, I can't yeah, that... tell the CC when you hop and shit. For Amenity, dude. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's been going on for ages, though, hasn't it? But, no, but it was, no, not, like, not the CC one. Often. Not yeah, to the now, same extent. <gasps> Yeah, this is crazy. This is really often. It's like every other world, man. Yeah. yeah. Like, I, I've gotten kicked out like five times just. That, trying really to find like what? Raids thing. and stuff? Oh, just like hopping char ships. Like, oh. I, I just get kicked out. <laughs> like, every other world. Yeah, it's so stupid. I don't know. I, I don't didn't know. even notice it until like two days ago, basically. I want to see if someone's put together like a theory thread, you know, like they did on like um, the tournaments where they fought Rot DDoS. You know, just that shit where they connect all the dots. I want to see that with like the CC group Iron Man and some other crazy shit going on. Yeah, yeah, there's yeah. someone with time on their hands. They can do it, you know. Someone with time on their hands. 
Yeah, it kind of happened after maintenance, though. <laughs> I don't know if you guys have been looking at the background pictures. I'm on RS I, Cute News. I've been, I've been looking what the fuck is this? <laughs> 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 He's got what a berserker that? necklace full of city and using rune darts on a... Wait, that's demon? a rune dart? Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh. What is that? It's a dragon Dude, dart. I, I, I love how, I love <laughs> how we all, like... Uh, like uh, as a community, we've all decided it's cute to uh, like see that be incredibly but, like, at shitty the at the game. Time, <laughs> yeah, being incredibly shitty at the game, but at the same time, I like know. we all fucking harass them in a way too. Yeah, you know, I would yeah, hug him, like, but I'm gonna make fun of him. You know, I would, I yeah. bring him to my house, but not before I laugh. <laughs> just, I love it. Holy shit, dude! <laughs> he's he's on his way to being a fully fledged granite warrior. Power any <laughs> just very close. He how, just needs the boots. And some of these the armor sets, though, it's like, how do you even find this setup, right? If you're looking up dragon, you might want to buy the dragon armor, but you look up granite, yeah. this man's this swapping is... shit, you know. <laughs> This is what you do. You just randomly go on a few wiki pages and like you like what you see, you buy. You know? <laughs> yeah, Shamal, hey. Oh my gosh, dude. Is Come this on. your new is this new your series, Come bro? That, just... That's a Varak only Lumbridge Ivory. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh it's good, man. It's nice. It's, it's amazing. Like, it's, the yeah. thing is, people play the game now, we're all guilty of it. We're all very efficient. It's yeah. like I it won't do me. I Play won't do anything unless I look up a guide and know that I'm doing it right. Yeah. Uh, exactly. Like, whereas these people, they're obviously new, so, like, they don't have a I fucking love it. clue. You know? No, yeah, I, I need they're, them they're to stay just, that way, honestly. I need them they're to just having that. fun. Right? Yeah. And the, the and thing is... And that's when you come in and PK him and yeah, pick on him. You take all their <laughs> shit, that's dude. When, that's when yeah. you skull trick him, man. Come on yeah, over the wilderness, ditch. Oh, my God. That's fucking brutal. And then they quit the game and never come back because of you. Dude. They all fucking... They might quit temporarily, but they all come back. They I, all come back, always. And a lot of people yeah, look at these guys, fun. man, and they, they kind of like go, how can you be this dumb? But for some reason, RuneScape on, doesn't man. feel like an MMORPG to us anymore. Because I've played yeah. other MMOs nah, back yeah, in the it's day. It's a community. It's, it's like yeah. a community. Now. Like, we're, we're just so into it. Like Right? We, dude, like, back in the day, like, you, you PK some guy in full fucking, you know, like, dragon and everything. People are like, oh my fucking god. You PK him now, like, these days... You either get they don't even drop responses. a like, you know? <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, you, you get two responses. You either get, oh, dude, you're a fucking dickhead. Like, oh, dude, people don't... It's either that or, oh, that's that's not real. People like that don't exist. Voting no to no, PvP no, no, no. updates. Lost my spade in the wild. <laughs> I fucking hate yeah, those well. people, dude. Uh, yeah, I, exactly. I, I, I mean, it, like, most of them are memers, but, yeah, there's a few yeah. series. What's happening a lot uh, now is I'll go and I'll attack somebody at Green Dragons that's killing a Green Dragon bot, and then when I kill them, they'll say sad. <laughs> Uh, yeah, <laughs> I'm like, man, what do you, you think you're wilderness? doing? <laughs> no, no, uh, dude, like when I was doing the the one video in um in what's it called Edge Dungeon, yeah, like like two or three people they bitched me the fuck out for just simply attacking them in the wild. Like this guy told me like I need to fucking get cancer and die in real life. Because oh. I'm attacking people who are just doing flare, and I'm sad as fuck for that. It's like, you are in the wild, you know that, right? He's like, yeah, but I'm just doing slayer. It's like, like I, I don't care. Yeah, you right? What the fuck? You have a crossbow, a slayer helmet, a fucking fury. What do you mean you're just doing slayer? You're fucking risking something. Oh, like, yeah. it, 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 people don't get it. Like, they have, yeah, like, they don't. fucking... They well, won't get it though. That's the thing. They I love when, it. like, uh, I'll find somebody that watched one of my guides, and I'll <laughs> kill them in a video. And they'll comment. And it's not, they're not even in the video, right? It's a shitty kill. They'll be like, you piece of shit. You took me out in the wild after watching your guides. I'm a subscriber. I'm a fucking subscriber. <laughs> the, com <laughs> the comments will be like, wow, man. You your shitty PK is like, oh, yeah, because I killed yeah. No, dude, it's I splashed favorite. some guy uh, like five times with entangles. He had black dehyde. I had fucking elder robes or whatever. And the guy says, you're uh, such a trash PK. <laughs> right? Like, <laughs> what, what do you want from me? Fucking... Come on, Merlin. Entangle hey, that I'm spell, not, right? Yeah, I'm not like... gonna lie. I, I, I'm not gonna call it a trash PK if I escape. I'm just like, wow, man. I can't believe I escaped that shit. You know, like... <laughs> <laughs> they're, they're, a tra they're a trash PK. They're a trash PK if they staff bash you 30 times. You know what I mean? Very, like, very that, that, that's the, the true definition of one of those. Yeah. What's the most times you ever splashed in the full rune? <laughs> 
Uh, full rune, I've splashed like four times, three, four times. I, I missed an entangle nine, or a TB on a guy in full rune nine times. Tenth time he <laughs> teleported. You know how frustrating that's, that's, that is? That's... That, that, no, that's not frustrating. That's disgusting. That's what that is. <laughs> I was almost about to break shit on my stream. It was like a year and a half yeah. ago. I'm like, all right, this guy's risking maybe like 100k. Let me get him. Tenth time, like if I, oh, you know, I just fucking, yeah. oh <laughs> my hey, god. Hey, either you you get the entangle or you don't. You know. <laughs> yeah, dude. I, I think the uh, I think the the overarching problem though with uh, like people getting upset that they're getting pk'd in the wild is because there's no risk anywhere else in the game like there used to yeah, be that's i agree people there used to be an assumed dynamic, risk yeah. of anything but now you can just bring full bandos and be more than fine to fucking you know go to bandos to bandos, to bandos whatever the fuck yeah like you let me tell you this is die. yeah this but, is like pussyscape now man yeah, well pretty much I, I kind of agree with Pussy Escape in a way, though. Now we got, like, yeah, DDoSers I mean, and shitty worlds. Yeah. Well, and... It's it's sad. We know I'm why 50, it's 50. like that. Yeah, yeah, I agree. Yeah, like, um, But there should be risk. But how can you implement risk when right, so, the servers so, are so shit, you know? Yeah. yeah, so, um, you know, so let's let's talk back when you could lose your stuff. You know, too many timers, right? Like or Random then, events yeah. when you died to, like, yeah. flowers. So, <laughs> yeah. so back then, right? If you died, it didn't matter how you died. If you died of your own cause or you DC'd or whatever, the situation, like, if, if you DC during that time, I mean, people it's still over. DC back then, yeah. right? So, like, so like that's always been a problem, right? Like, before two minute or after the one hour update, like, people have always complained that if you die to a DC, it's frustrating, I get it. But yeah. back then, like, people just had to deal with it, right? Because yep. it's two minutes, everyone played by that, so. I couldn't even and, imagine and they do it now. really bad internet, Guess what, man? You you not you are not PVM uh, unless you're playing like that's you're not doing much. Yeah. So yeah. Exactly. it sucks, but it, it, it as you're saying, it is, it is what it is. Yeah, it exactly. Is is. And I didn't really hear too many people like you know say, oh, get rid of two minute timer because I have shitty internet. I mean, back. I mean, like, cause you know people had dial up back in. Yeah, oh yeah. Sure, so. Yeah, exactly. I missed that really sound. I didn't hear too many people complain about it then. So so I don't really like the argument where some people say no man don't don't punish me because i have bad internet you know i'm like well people used to play like that all the time with yeah the time i could only imagine an iron That's man with deal. shitty internet yeah. but like two years of gear on him dying to like some dumb shit and losing it and then just right yeah. it blows up because like because yeah. like back when i played like you know when i was like newer but still right two minute timer i i would not bring risky stuff most of the time i feel like we've all played for a very long time have exactly. we not yeah, yeah exactly. I've been yeah. playing since 2004. I used to main Roblox, yeah, but yeah. Well, same for me. Yeah. Yeah, Dude, I, I remember Roblox, yeah. the yeah. old the old death mechanics. Probably the most uh, frustrating time that I ever had. Do you guys remember a client called SwiftKit? Oh yes. Yep. Okay. I use this. I use this. They, yep. they, they called themselves the official cheat <clears throat> client. Remember oh, that? God, yeah. <laughs> well, uh, it all, all it really had it, it had well, an switch. IRC. Yeah, it, they it had, had the switch. IRC. Yeah, what the switch? Like like uh, world switching without like the yeah 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. and that was considered that cheating. was revolutionary yeah. that dude. was revolutionary that dude. was I, yeah, yeah, I can't go back that. to fucking logging and typing anymore so, oh my god I don't know if you guys bro. remember but they used to get like bug splats every now and then or at least mine did and I never forget I was going to kill Aviancy's in God Wars I had Ranger boots uh Rain oh. Robin Hood hat and like some dehyde or whatever as soon as i clicked down to go into god wars and i didn't have any sarah dome item or anything like that i got the message and all i could do was watch <laughs> while my character got destroyed by all of the fucking sarah dome army oh my yeah God. and I, lo I lost so much and i was so fucking pissed. were you recording it all I, just, or? I had to watch no i, I didn't oh damn but I, I just i just watched it and i was like crying oh uh, yo guys like I'm, this is the yeah, perfect yeah, time one. to segue into all right this is the perfect time to segue into into a time like one of the the worst times I ever died. Like back in the, back when there was a two minute. Like I was a scrub back then, and yeah. and I I got like I saved so much money. I fished so much sharks to avoid <laughs> like oak guttons or something. You know I was like level hundred or something doing Slayer, but like God Wars was really new and I didn't really know my shit around God Wars. So so I got a Slayer task. It was like spiritual spiritual creatures, creatures? somewhere. Yeah, and I was like, okay, I'm gonna go to the Zami one because I remember on release day I went there and all there was was Zami, so I should be okay. But I forgot how to get to like the, I forgot it was like north north. So when I went in, 
in the middle. I didn't have like the other protections, and I started panicking. I was like, "Oh shit, where's Sammy? I don't know where it is." So then I went the opposite way. I went south, and that's where oh. like the camera guys and like AVNCs and shit were. And and I was just like, I didn't know what to do. I, I fucking freaked out, and I died because I got piled by all the other mobs. So yeah. I like, I, so like, I forgot what drop. It was like Guthrie Spirit shit. I was so I was like panicking my ass off trying to get there, and I actually made it. I literally made it within like probably ten seconds. But some dude was there too. He was actually <laughs> going to God Wars at the same time. I was gonna go and pick up my shit. So I was literally racing that guy down to the to the middle, and he noticed the red dot. So he actually went for it. I was like, no, please, oh. <laughs> like, don't pick up my stuff. And so I was like, I was trying my best, like you know, just just compete with the guy. And I picked up half the stuff. He picked up half of my stuff. And I quit the game for like half a year. I got the spear, bro. I was like, yo, I the legacy of weeks. Rice Cup almost I shortened. Know, I spent two weeks yeah. fishing for my guttons, dude. Oh my god, dude. The, the the one thing about it though is that like oh, I've kind of yeah. realized is yeah. that that was probably gonna happen. If not then, it was probably gonna happen at some other point in time. Yeah. If like you just don't know, and like I I feel like all of us kind of go through that, yeah. like to where something bad happens. Like I, I remember. The worst thing that happened to me was I PK'd this guy with Mystics in a dark boat in the BH crater. I remember oh. how you had to tank for three minutes. Yeah, that was ridiculous. Yeah, before you could leave, yeah. yep. Mm-hmm. Yep, so I I tanked up until... Like, I remember, I went in there, I ran, I found the Debo. I looted that crap, and no one was on me for, like, the first 100... Or, like, what, like, 100 seconds or something like that? Or whatever it was. Maybe, like, the first, like... You know, minute or yeah, something. Yeah, you have to tank like, like three minutes exactly. or something. Yeah. Yeah, it, it was three minutes, I think. Yeah, three minutes. Seconds. Yeah. yeah, it was on for yeah. the minute. Exactly. Yeah, 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 yeah. So no one was on me. I think for like the first minute or something like that, and then one guy just kind of starts attacking me, and I'm like, "Why are you even attacking me? Like, like he was probably my target or something." But like, I figured there's no reason you should be attacking me because you know you you just kind of randomly walked by me and saw me and started attacking me, so like. Stop! Stop! Doing that. <laughs> Please. And, and then, and then one other guy hopped on me. And oh, I, don't, I don't know how it, how it was. Like there was like a possibility of three people on you, right? Like three people could attack you. Yeah, you could, Yeah, you had to tank hard. It was I either guess. three or four. No, I, yeah, I it, it, it was two or, was two oh, or three. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. I remember. You could definitely have three, a hundred percent. Yeah, yeah. Dude, the mechanics for that were fucking wild, though. Yeah, it so, was wild. I, I, yeah. I was sitting there tanking three fucking people, running around, panicking. It, I got down to, like, I think 18 seconds before I could get out, and I ran out of food, and I died. And I fucking quit for, like, two, three months, dude. Dude, yeah, like, <laughs> that uh, Depots were, like, a few mil back then, and that Ooh, was, like, the biggest PK. I, yeah, that was the biggest PK I ever got. Like, <laughs> that bothered me for a long fucking time, dude. <laughs> Like, for a really long time, I just uh, sit there remembering, oh, my God, like, I got <laughs> fucked over that day. Dude, I remember the first Skull Sword I ever bought was a Bandal Skull Sword, and it Yo, cost, same. it was it was 40 mil. 40 same. mil? Those were 40? Yep. I bought my first Skull Sword for 40 mil. Yep. yep. You guys were rich. Like that. <laughs> it was 40 rich. mil. Yeah, I, I never when... had 40 mil. Dude, it was so, when the okay, big craters first came out, and I remember I went inside, I ran to the center, and this kid in Mystic, and I remember he had an Aram's top, started attacking me, and I started whacking him, and he wasn't eating. And I was like, oh, shit, I'm about to PK Barrows for the first time. Then his whole clan falls in <laughs> on me, like, wow. like, like 20, 30 people. And being the fucking idiot I was and not knowing what the mechanics were, I just specked him and killed him. And then they just killed me for my god sword, and I spawned oh, outside yeah. with nothing in my inventory, and I was just like, dude, like that's right. Right. Oh. Like that. dude, especially like the way that they would do it, like debate people with the the plus ones. I remember they would uh, fight you for a little bit on another account, and then they would run away, uh, and you know, like you leave the crater or whatever, and then you go back in, then you get. You teleport to like one of the people in the clans in the middle, and they start attacking you. And then one person in their clan kills the bait account, so that's how you got that. And that's exactly yeah. what happened to you, but in a different way. Like yeah, the way the way I did it was even stupid. Stu- yeah, mine was just yeah. stupid. I just straight up killed him. I was just like, I'm happy to kill this guy. It's an Aaron's top. I didn't even get a loot in, man. I got fucked, dude. I was, I remember yeah. I just spawned outside, and I I wasn't. I, I don't even think I was that pissed off. I was just like. 
guess I'm going back to God Wars. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah, that was literally my reaction to it. <laughs> Dude, I, I sold never even my had the back. money for that. I never even had the fucking Dude, money. Yeah, how are these people so rich back in the day? I didn't even I'll know Varrock was a I'll fucking city what, for I'll, two months. I'll, I did. I'll tell you how I made my breakthrough. So I knew some friends that knew really high level friends. They were like Max Combat. I was like 105. I was, I was pussy as hell. I was not going no God Wars. But, yeah. but they invited me, you know? They were like, hey, you want to go God Wars? I'm like, what? I'm like, yeah. It's like, <laughs> I'm, I'm going to die, though. It's like, don't worry. I, I got you. It's like, I was like, I, I still remember Chris Hover, mm -hmm. like, and his friends. They, oh, they hooked me up so nice, man. I I, I became millionaire overnight, dude. First yeah. BCP split off minion, bro. Like, dang. I knew, uh, it was, it was, I knew I was there. I was, I was making I'll it. tell you guys a story of karma. <laughs> and it really bit me in the ass, right? So... When um, Loot Share first came out, it wasn't Coin Share, it was just Loot Share. Oh, yeah, just I remember that. And it was like the exact time when God Wars came out, or maybe a bit after. And I, I got a team on the RuneScape forums, because that's what you did back in yeah. the day. You went on the mm -hmm. forums and looked yeah. for whatever. I had like a whip and like no decent gear at all. I ended up sniping a BCP. The first thing I ever saw on Loot Share was a BCP. And I was oh, with like yeah. five guys and everyone was like, oh, that's like 2.5 mil or whatever the split was. And like, I can get, oh, yeah. they, we were so newbie, they were like, oh, we can get 70 prayer with that. And, and then the trip, out. I, nope. I just tell you the way, man. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I just, did. I, just jacked, I was yeah, gone. Yeah. And then, like, Dude. literally the same week, I upgraded my gear. BCP sold for like 20 mil. I was balling. Oh, Guffins, my God. Yuri, like, yo. Bro, and, uh, yeah, you I are got, the got, worst yeah. person. Oh, Dude, my God. I got I got another team on the forums. You're doing it I, again. I, no, no, no <laughs> I died. I died, right? And they let me join, and I was tanking, but then I died. And oh. this was the time when you had the graves, and the graves lasted for, like, 60 seconds or 120 seconds, unless yeah, someone on your blessed tier. it. Yeah, yeah. And I was like, hey, guys, can you bless my grave? And then I'm like, Sorry. uh, no. actually, you scammed our friend the other day for a BCP. I lost, oh, like, 12 God. mil, man. I was still the like, mega wow, car. Yeah. <laughs> Dude. Oh, hey, man. You, I would, were, you were an asshole. So. I would like to share a story yeah, on behalf of the victims, dude. Come on, All right. Behalf of the victims. Behalf of the victims, dude, I man. never fucking scam people. I got... My friend fucking scammed me. Dude, the reason why my YouTube name is um, I Skim Loot, like the user of it, yeah, the reason why it's I Skim Loot is because I used to have a name Skimbles, like with like random fucking numbers back then. And then uh, I met this one kid. His name was Munch. Like, I'm Munch a lot or something like that. I forget what it, whatever it was. The fat and ass. We made... I guess we, we made we made twin peers. He was from the UK. We made twin peers, and it was Rexy. And um, he his was, <laughs> it was Rexy, dude. His was, <laughs> his been. was I munch loot, and mine was I skim loot. So that's where I got it. Um, and like we were fucking boys, right? Like we PK <laughs> together. We did everything together. You you remember the the twin accounts? But like, yeah, yeah. You guys remember that shit? So then, like a year later. He uh, he says that he needs uh, money because he's making a PK video. He made one PK video before. Um, Can we find it? <laughs> I I don't remember it. Like I'll, it. I'll try to look it up. I'll try to look it up here. I munch loot RuneScape PK video. If it's Instant there, it's there. Yeah, no, it's not there. I'll, I'll try to find it later. That's funny. Yeah, dude, I'd love really to see that. <clears throat> Some sweet yeah, edits. But, yeah, but <laughs> he um. He said that he needed to get some loot so he could help for like a big PK video, and he'll give me the uh, the stuff back after. So I I had like uh, I think a Debo or something like that back then. I had like a seven mil bank, and I gave him two mil cash, saying like, "Oh, here you can just use that." And then he's like, uh, "Okay, you just wait here. I'll go record it." And like we were all the way uh, at Lumberyard, and he ran up. He's like, oh my god, I died, I died. And then, like, I immediately teleported to Lumbridge because I kind of figured it was going to happen. And he wasn't in Lumbridge. And I said, uh, where are you? He was like, oh my god, I died. And I was like, well, what, what did you uh, protect? He said, I protected three sharks. And I what? fucking, I, I, yeah, I, I looked at his gear and I didn't say anything at the time. Um, and he had, like, black knee height and stuff. I was like, how did you protect three sharks? Like, what do you mean? And, like, for some reason, because I, I was also, like, Five IQ back then. I was like, you would have at least kept the, you would have at least kept the rune arrows. But like, no, fucking dehide. Like, what you uh, I know. Yeah, right. He has dehide. Stuff. That's so yeah, good, dude. dude. And, and he, he scammed me for the two mil. It's like I've never even fucking done anything to anyone. You kidding me? So you yeah. want wonder what I fucking did? Like, about like uh, a week later or two weeks later, yeah. I did my first fucking lure. 
That's when I started learning. Oh, yeah. and the <laughs> legend was made, dude. Yeah. Fuck. Yeah. So, if, hey, if you want to thank anyone for why I'm here today, thank that fucking kid for scamming me two mil. He dicked me over. <laughs> what have you uh, made? That, what have you that made, was dude? Be Rixie's dog. Oh, never mind. I <laughs> thought Rixie's dog was going to be the next. Uh, He's cute, man. Right He's there. a cute dog. That's yeah. crazy. So, that's yeah, the origin. Is. I like the origin. That's the story, origin, man. That's the, the origin, origin, though, dude. Dude, and now we got a title The Origin of Frame oh, Scams, yeah. dude. Yeah. <laughs> Only on OSR's podcast. Where are the scamming begins? It exclusive. <laughs> Hey, oh. hey, there's a difference between scamming and learning. You're a bad hey, Everyone, dude, hit the dislike. I, <laughs> I had loads of shit, dude. Way. I got my bestest friend on fucking RuneScape. I know his, his name was Guffix Range. He was my boy as well. We used to talk every single day on Vintrilo. We used to do everything together. He Ooh. knew my information. One day, I logged in after school. Bank gone. Everything. This is why you don't have so friends, fucking, kids. Like, fire cape destroyed. Oh! What? He gone. destroyed your fire cape? Yeah, he just, he just did it. And like, I messaged him. I was like, dude, what the fuck? And he was just like, yeah. He's like, I just wanted to take your stuff. And I was just like, wow. <laughs> wow. This should be like, at least save the fire cape. What are you why doing? Why would he right? destroy your Trust fire me, cape, I, man? I, I've got many a, a stories of when I got yeah, scammed. Yeah, same. I have so much. Like, loads, man. Like, right, this I'll shit didn't it. just I'll come out it. of nowhere. This, you know, yeah. you're, you're a product of your environment. And the yeah. environment I was in wasn't a very good one. Yep. Yeah, man. Yo, man, what was your story, though, about dying? <clears throat> Oh, oh, my victim story here, because Rakesy brought it up from Jack yeah. and Tassie. Is, I was back yeah. when I was, like, a streamer for a year and a half, and I would do a lot of group events with my, my like, ten viewers, you know, go out and take some shit over. And I'm doing a group so mass adorable. for Bandos, and I think we had seven people? And little did I know, back in the day, Kids PK used to actually be somebody on Twitch. You know what I mean? If you guys remember Kids, or was it? Yep. I yeah. Remember. Kids PK. I think it was Kids PK. He, he, had, or... he had the name, um, like, Kids Rank. Or whatever. Oh, kids rank. It's not yeah, my. He's famous, bro. It's not my. It's yeah. not my uh, boy. It, it wasn't him though. He he, he oh, bought the name or something. Oh, okay. He bought not the, the original, original, not the OG. I'm trying to get the right yeah. name right because I I'm friends with one of these PKers now and he's a chill guy, a black dude. But no, kids PK was uh it was different and he joined us at Bandos. I didn't know at the time, but I kind of seen one of his streams. I'm like, okay, I, I kind of recognize that name. He's not gonna scam loot, right? We're all sharing, right? The rules yeah. were um. We're made. Well, I guess who gets Tassies, dude? This fucking guy <laughs> oh, off a of minion, and we're ecstatic. My ass is maybe like eight mil bank or something, dude. So I'm just like, yeah, dude. My boys get like a <laughs> ten mil split, and I was excited for my boys, dude. And we get back to Edgeville because we asked him, he's gonna split. He's like, yeah, we get back to Edgeville, and uh, we're all chilling there, waiting for the split. And he just starts dancing. We're like, what's going on, dude? <laughs> oh you gonna? Oi, like in my defense, yeah. If I was gonna split those kids. I'm, no, nah, I'm lying. I was gonna say the BH Crater was out. Was the only way. I was a cunt, man. I, Dude, I, I, knew, I was you just agree. The, the story does not stop there because he starts dancing. I get upset. I'm like, wow, what a what a shitty shitty person, right? All right, whatever. Sorry, boys. I was you know I was angry. My boys couldn't get the loot, man, because I care about my boys. So I try to get some content going to make up for it. Yeah, well, yeah, I have fucking 8 mil bank. So I go out and I start PKing a little bit. I don't know how to use F keys. Well, what's he do, dude? He rags the shit out of me with the tats it's on in a what PvP a world. Shit. Right? And then, like, a douche, and he starts roasting me on his own stream. And back in the day, 10 viewers versus, what, 250 or whatever? Yeah. Fucking, oh, man, I was so angry. Now it's... I mean, what, did he say that you scammed or something too or like some bullshit no nah, he just fucking like he hosted me once and they all spam tacits and shit i'm like man, come on man. <laughs> <laughs> Dick. yeah wow. yeah i'm wow. not a... so everyone, everyone everyone knew that you got fucking scammed and they didn't give a shit <laughs> not even dude, once dude, uh, yeah, yeah. dude it's, it's, people it's are just fucking whole... assholes yeah, yeah. It's, it's, assholes, bro. it's group thinking man like, they all need to get, you know? <laughs> the fuck is yeah. that how do you even come up with that? That man no, has done on. the quest right, for the please, D Halley. Please come don't on. Hate on the Dragon Halley because I used to literally do every task with my Dragon. Watch yeah, man. Okay. I used to do That's that over Rune Halley. Dude, man. when RuneScape Dragon one. Uh, Iron Man just came out, me and my boy B Boy both got Dragon Halleys like the first couple days. What do we do? This man goes up the lava dragon is trying to kill one of a tally from far range, <laughs> and I'm doing Firebolt or whatever. And I think it was um. Oh, like an hour in, he killed it. I'm thinking, dude, you're done. <laughs> Cause it's not worth. It's not worth. Like, yeah, no. Go bank that, yeah. man. Just that's. Yeah. It's ingenious. That's a I love beautiful it, man, idea. Honestly.
<laughs> I love this thing, man. It's amazing. This is what amazing. Is it, that, that was me back in the day. That's a rune <laughs> Halley right there. Yeah, I, dude, it took me a while to upgrade to the D Halley because Regicide was on. I PK'd amazing. a guy. Oh, God. My, my, my mistake. Go ahead. I don't want to cut you off. Oh, no. God, I didn't. I didn't. It was nothing. No, no, dude, no. That's not, I'm, I'm a dick now. Go. No, no, what was I the just, story, man? Said, You're gonna have to shout out all our channels now, man. It's said, over. It took a while to upgrade to the register because uh, regicide was a bitch. That's all it was. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. regicide was good, man. I'm, I'm surprised dude, they were able to do I, it. I, I, was, I, was gonna, so. yeah, I, I was gonna interrupt for some shit anyway. Like I was just yeah. going to say, I PK'd some guy the other day for a fucking rune halley, and that's what it reminded me of. <laughs> the guy was running around in zamorak robes and a fucking rune halley. Like I, I don't know what he thought was going on, but. I don't know if you guys saw know. one of my videos at Revs, but I run into this guy in full snakeskin at Revs with a rune halley. And I'm like, okay, this man needs to be preserved oh, in a that. museum. Yeah, right? So I'm chilling, and then this guy comes, and I'm PKing, trying to get my Rev world back. So I'm just ranging him. He doesn't have a bracelet. He's taking damage. Well, he runs to the 30 line where the guy is, and right before he teleports, the guy <laughs> fucking jabs him with the halley and almost kills him. And I'm thinking, I would have gave him skull. all of the loot right there if he got that. Like... <laughs> <laughs> the best shit. I just bro, he's like he's like an ambush predator. Right? <laughs> he's like, he's like, a noob, like a... and when you're low HP, he'll pounce on your ass. He's like the little crabs yeah. at the ocean, man. He'll just take your ass, bro. Just yeah, he'll pinch you real fast. I will never forget that moment. He changed my life. I love him. I know. It's Beautiful. like damn. Don't underestimate snakes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Are but... we gonna talk about any of the uh, uh, talking points we came up with? Or are we just gonna go um? On? What are the what are the talking points? I, didn't even I think that. we had like lowlands. I think. But... I mean, we talked about this before. But, yeah, um, but it's just recent, so I don't know. Or like, um, what do you guys? You know, the the question that that gets asked all the time is like, what do you think about Kibble's lowlands? When when the question really is more like, so are you guys excited or not? You know, excited. Yeah. Oh, I'm excited, I'm, I'm, but I'm I don't excited. know what, what the stream when it comes out. Lowlands. You I... know the thing that like didn't yeah. come out yet. Did yeah. That's uh, what I think about that. Yeah. Uh, when, nah. when, when is it coming out? When's it released? Thursday. Uh, Thursday. This Thursday? Oh, shit. Yeah, okay. yeah that's Thursday. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, keep up. What What? What am I going to do? I don't, I'm not going to do the boss. Don't, see, I don't even have, have to have fuck follow. the stream, they, dude. They don't have fear of missing out, man. You know? uh, I'm not even sure what to do when it comes out, man. I feel like I'm left out. Uh, Cause everyone's going to yeah. be streaming the boss. There's no way you're going to get yeah. any viewers doing that. Basically, yeah. I would be over there killing the farm boss, trying to stand out like a dumbass. <laughs> Yo, oh dude, do, do like a nature documentary on Kebbles Falling. Like, okay, we're exploring new content, so we're gonna... If I had the scribe orb, I would love to do a documentary yeah, like that. we're gonna that. zoom in on everything and anything, so... I just hope the, uh, the Elysian goes up, and I'm gonna sell it, because it's gonna crash afterwards. Do you know yeah. that the, the Ellie sold this month for, like, close to a bill? What? Like, there were what? two of them that sold for, like... Uh, I think oh. it was like 900 mil. It was nuts. It's only two of them. Yeah, That's those, all those... of my bank. Holy yeah, shit. Yeah, those dude. are price manipulations, though. Those yeah. those are price manipulations. Dude, so, I so slapped you, you my alien. It's like their friends buying it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, it, it's they're they're just meant to cause uh, panic and get a merch out of you, basically. Uh... Okay, <laughs> it's a bit risky though, right? Just in no, case. Not really, like... no, not really. With high with items that don't get like traded and sold. Yeah, out, low volume really... items you can you can get away with, it, especially on like uh like a uh, low activity part of the day like really late in the day yeah, yeah. okay okay but uh, i don't yeah, know it's, i'm it's, not much yeah. of a merger i don't really know the g very well yeah some people do that um it, ha it happens once in a while but it causes you know a lot of panic though because like people spot out on that shit but yeah um yeah people are merching the hell out of uh, a lot of you know high high-end items oh i bet i always miss out on that. the merches always miss out yeah. ah. and the and the thing is is that like it's not even like Veteran merchers, I mean, that's all obviously part of it, but like a lot of people in general, they're trying to get into the speculative market right here. Right. For Capital Soul Land, so everything's going up. But right. honestly, like some people like like to sell before the update because that's like the they high think point. That's their maximal, maximal profit. And then some people like to hold out and wait. So so right now, you're probably already seeing some like items going like up and down like crazy, like wild, wild. Yeah, um, I think Dragon Hunter Crossbow, you know, it had it had like a it had like a pretty hard crash like last week, you know, it dropped like forty mil or some shit. Right, you need an item. It's not a dragon though, is it? So... Oh, um, well, it is a dragon. It's, it's a three head. They're, oh. they're all dragons. They're all dragons. Yeah, everything. Okay. In, uh, are dragons. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, never mind then. Everything cool. in that new dungeon, like the four monsters or three of them, they're all classified dragons. 
But we don't know if it's like gonna be weak to Giant Hunter Crossbow because like what they could do is slap like Nigel range defense like they did with Bloat. And then it would it wouldn't matter, you know, if you had a giant hunter crossbow. That's yeah, that's true. Do Need right. Give so, me yeah, an item yeah, to merch. I'll, I'm gonna go yeah, log in right, right now. I'm gonna buy a hundred million an item. All right, what, what item, rice? One second. This is the Dude, important all I'm question. Playing. Yeah, yeah. Do hydras breathe fire? Um, they said no. They said you don't need anti fire for for the. Oh well, there you go. Okay, yeah. I was gonna say because DFSs should be going up in that case. But, it, yeah. it did go up, and then once they announced it, it went down. <laughs> you know. What I'm okay. Saying? Yeah, but yeah, there's not too I'm much waiting, I'm just waiting for my uh, 300 vehicles that I have in the bank to become useful. Oh yeah. my god, how much are those oh, each? Oh, I know one day they're gonna make it as like a consumable for some some upgrade. Yeah, uh, it's, I, it's I feel inevitable. like they're going to. It's an eventually. Yeah, yeah, they're gonna get like, around to it. You're yeah, gonna be they, rich in the guy who bought climbing like, boots. Yeah, Tebow. Oh no, man, put a circle into it. Yeah, because, like, you know, there are um, the defense reduction spot weapons, but there's really, like, Circle's kind of like magic reduction, but it's so bad. Because you, you, you pretty much do, like, no damage. Most of our, it's really inaccurate, too. Yeah, they so want maybe us... they'll make a stronger version of People it. People have been asking it's... me to do, like, the Circle at Rev Caves massing video. I'm like, dude, how am I going to kill anybody with that? Just hit somebody, <laughs> no mage left or something, but... Uh... Yeah, what do you do? <laughs> it would be so dumb. Does the Circle have a spec? Yeah, it yeah, lowers their magic attack, I believe. If yeah, you hit by, what, it, wow. by what it's you gonna, hit, but... it's gonna castle wars. That's pretty by much. Yeah, yeah. It? yeah, it, it lowers what you hit, but but your max hit is so low though, and your what accuracy is, it? is bad. It's like you can use like rune arrows or something, so you can like a, maybe up to twenty with rigor, but but like you're gonna Ew. miss a lot though, so that's not even good. No, yeah, it's horrible. No, it's not good. Yeah, it's, it's bad. Not good. <laughs> yeah, is it got the same stats as an MSB? No, it's, it's much like worse. Slower. It's even slower, man. It's slower. Oh, man, that, that item needs... I don't know if it needs a rework, but yeah, it's worthless. It looks cool, though. I mean, they, they, like, they should make it, they should make it uh, the cheap t -bow. You know what I mean? Like, I, I feel like if they introduce a niche weapon... That, that, wasn't, that wasn't serious, by the way. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, yeah, if they introduce it as a niche, uh, a niche weapon in the future where you can use it as an upgrade, that's okay. Because I feel like, our, uh, you know, like, DK's is already amazing money, so, like, they definitely don't need the buff. There's got to be a reason for this weapon in the future, because look how badass that is, dude. It's like a whole fireworks show when you get hit. Yeah. I was thinking, I was trying to do use it at court, but it's so bad. Yeah. You know, it's not even... I mean, it's not it's not relevant mm -hmm. PKN because who doesn't PK with restore potions nowadays? Like, right. it, it, there's just no use for it. Like, I mean, is like the drinks, <clears throat> the drinks gotta be strong. Dude, you gotta get one on dead man mode and just hit somebody once on day like two. Can't, can't mage no more. Oh, oh my god. Yeah, yeah no it, it would work in that scenario, yeah, but if you can get one and kill no, the DKs it, it, on day it, two. Isn't there super stores in the BH shop too now? Yeah, yeah. they've changed, yeah, they've changed yep. that, so, so yeah, no, you're still no. <laughs> Sad. <laughs> There's yeah. no use. There's no use, Sad. <laughs> There's no use, dude. One day. I can't act can... Wait, can you guys think of an item which is more irrelevant than the circle? Uh, burnt bread. <laughs> no, like a weapon. Like a weapon. Bread. Uh, stale I mean, bread. It's, it's a supposed weapon. to have a use, right? But it just doesn't. Yeah, know? I mean, let's be honest. There's there's a lot of stuff in this game that doesn't really yeah. have a use, or it's been outlived by yeah. other better things. And that's what makes that's it beautiful, like... right? Yeah. Yep. yep. Survival. <laughs> I think that's why they probably won't like ever rework it. Like, I hope they do, but like they probably won't. I mean, like, like think about it this way: is is has the circle ever been useful? Has mm -hmm. is there any meaning to making it better? Because there has there's no historical time in the game where like we valued it, the circle. Yeah, that's true. So it like, depends. why would it matter, right? That I don't think it, it was ever like used like widespread. When was yeah. when were the Dagonoff Kings released? Does anybody know? Early two thousand six, right? Okay, yeah. so like back in the day at Mage Bank, like when people first started PKing at Mage Bank, uh, they did it like when Bruise didn't even exist. So they take like a super defense, attack, strength, free prayer potion, and the rest would be sharks and a uh, a lock pick. Like back then, it could have actually been useful because it would have stopped them barraging. But that is literally it. That's the only thing I can yeah, think. Yeah, like I, I never remember it being iconic. Like no, it, it wasn't. No. no, even the so, crystal bow is iconic. Like so, like my yeah. main, like I, I think my main argument, I guess, is what I'm trying to say for uh, making something better is if the thing that we're trying to make better was iconic, and it has like a really important, like, 
uh, cultural value to the cultural game. value. <laughs> yeah, then maybe like we do something about it. But like circle is what whatever. I mean, you use it for a clue scroll. So if you are, you know. Yeah, that, that that's scroll. literally the only use. Yeah, that's that fine. I I feel like there are there's just no way to make everything good because uh, at the end of the day, if you make everything good, some of them are gonna become uh, not as good compared to like. And you just you gotta know, keep rising the, the. Yeah, and then you'll just overpowered have to keep cap. It better, better. Yeah. What I would like to see though is just uh, more variety, matter, yeah. more variety yeah. for spec weapons because I'm sure they could find a spec weapon that could. <clears throat> add to pvp in a way without being super strong like how the dds yeah, is to the yeah. gmall you know da, da, da. something yeah like no variety weapons that helps you like insta kill someone that's why i'm that. excited for dragon knives you know spec bar on a yeah. knife like that's gotta be fun I'm yeah a, I, i'm I, looking I mean, forward to those i'm, I'm so, just looking forward to logging in teleporting to varrock center and not having some guy with a fucking salamander attack me <laughs> <laughs> like that's I feel like that should probably be a priority. Kill. Yeah, um, those dragon else. knives are actually, they look pretty powerful. I was actually going to ask you, Frame, all your content's usually around the PvP worlds, and I never go into PvP worlds because I had a, you know, just horrible experience. Uh, are the updates making them more friendly for just, you oh. know, no? no. <laughs> <laughs> are they still absolute shit? They're, they're, people are just afraid of getting banned at this point uh, because, like, people have been banned for fucking Good. me and yeah. yeah, I mean, they should, but at the same time, they should get banned for ragging anyone. Right? You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, not just yeah, me. They don't, they don't have proper YouTube. enforcement for a lot of... The uh, report system in PvP is garbage. Stuff, so. Yeah, yeah it's, it's more it, like it just, garbage. It just looks bad. Yeah, but you like, have to be a concentrator. I'm not that's why I don't do it, especially on stream. You just get, like, uh, slapped. Dude, their excuse, though, for it, uh, Jagex, like, they said, just report it when you see it. Uh, uh, like, we said, like, you guys should just be on that shit and they said well no we can't dedicate someone to it full time it's like i get that but if people get like immediately fucking banned like when they go there and like you do it for like even like a month no one's gonna uh, do it like, yeah, yeah, word yeah will no, spread. no one's word gonna do spread. it word will spread and people yeah. will stop doing it mm -hmm. and if people think that you know they, they start getting a little less shy and they're like oh they're not gonna fucking ban me yeah let's do it again do you, do you think there should be a report option which is literally titled ragging and then uh, yeah, it's, it's under harassment, no, but no, they're not gonna go through it. No, no, because people would just uh, call anything harassment. Yeah, like, yeah, I, but I, what I'm saying, game mods need to clearly define like it, well, actually this... not, not clearly defined like whatever they think is harassment. I think that that's why they need to uh, crack down on because like technically speaking, if those guys gear up in fucking full torags and whatever and start PKing with a crystal bow. Like that could be seen as ragging, although it's technically not. But I, I think I think the ultimate thing that needs to get taken care of is the people that just sit there and harass people with yeah. those fucking one items. I agree. I just yeah. does do you ever I mean you might feel more powerful when you report people, but when I report anybody for doing anything shitty on this game, I feel like I'm throwing a dart at a wall that's just like a mile long and no one's gonna look at that dart, you know? It's just pointless. It's pointless. Wrong. Yeah, and that's probably why people just get away with shit in the wild all the time because no, there's that, no that, power that behind the report, shit. you know, and they should put some power behind it so that yeah, it feels exactly. like you're doing something. It's it's a problem, and I think that above all else, it's like a, a structural problem, so to speak. Yeah, and I actually brought this up at um, a TwitchCon uh, when RuneScape was hosting Dev Mode. They actually had like a host for questions. I brought it up, and then I got ragged three months straight on stream. <laughs> I saw that clip. Oh yeah. my god, it was so funny, dude. <laughs> oh what man. did you say? I, I, I want to watch it, man. I want to watch that. I clip. don't even know. I, if you could find it, we could watch <laughs> it. But I was just like, hey, are you gonna do anything about the toxicity of the wild? And they're like, <laughs> we're gonna work are you, on like, it. Booed off the stage. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, I. I would hope that would put me in good regards with the J mods, but they have not sent me a, anything or promoted me in any way after that. And I'm thinking, is that no, dude? Like, like something I did? Oh, you know, why not happened? What? Like, I I feel like they were kind of like like get the fuck out of here with that. You know what I mean? Like they kind of got like annoyed by like that you asked a question like that, where it was like. Ask us questions about content, not fucking, not your own stupid problems that don't matter. But that, yeah, exactly, man. I just don't feel even part of the OSR's team in a way, because I just, I have not got any response back to anything. I'm gonna be on the front page. I literally DM'd Archie like, "Do you want me to promote RuneScape in a way or mobile?" I had no, no response, nothing. And I'm just wondering, is it because I give a shit about the wild, or 
I'm not sure, man. It's no, it's it's not gonna give a shit. I think people just don't give a shit there. Like I think they have other priorities, and Ies leaving is a really big step back for uh, Jagex PVP. Yeah. yeah. It's yeah, I mean, he was he back. was pretty uh, down to he was pretty open about controversies, which you know, dude, I I he's a I he, like, uh, I think Archie does something different. Uh, like uh, like he is pretty much like I think he's like our, our our lifeline for content creators, but like not for PvP. Although he does like do stuff for that, so like that that's not his like job role. That's not his description. He has so much crap to do, and I'll, I'll give him that. He's but, like. Like I, 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 I used to did I used to did shit about PvP, so I would assume that Sweden would be our next bet. But mm. I don't think that he cares about PvP that much. I, I could be I could be wrong. I would. I like I like him as a person. I mean... I, I'm not <clears throat> saying anything negative on him. I'm just saying yeah. I, I don't think that's where his priorities lie. And I think yeah. that we yeah. I'm I mean like there's uh, a lot of underlying issues with like. The, you know different aspects of the game skilling pv and pvp well, and i feel like they don't have the people that are dude i will volunteer myself to be a wildy j mod all right yeah well here's the thing Here, here's the thing that i think bothers me they don't value having a j mod specifically for that stuff yeah uh, i feel like i, I, I think should. i use a kind of yeah i feel i feel like i use a kind of was like but that's because he did it on his own time um mm. but they don't value um pvp that much they when, value dead man mode because it's marketing but that's fucking strictly when 80 percent of your game is doing slayer you know it's hard yeah. to like, focus so on I and i agree that. and i get that but Not as well that. but at the same time you know what's the best shit to watch on twitch which has the most views PvP. on youtube what is some of the best thing for this game to get actually any coverage for even an esport is PvP, not skilling or fledging, or those exactly. tournaments get nowhere on Twitch. And if there's no one that's gonna Don't do anything, give anything about it, fuck Don't yeah. Give a fuck about the skill, remember? Like nobody. No did one gave a skill. shit. I was like, maybe I mean, I'll try it. Then I'm like, I'm not gonna skill for 24 hours. Fuck that. Yeah, Wooks, Wooks made it interesting. Everything else. That, that's because that's Wooks though. I mean, I mean, Wooks who made Goblin yeah. killing interesting, man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He'll it's... probably calculate the best trajectory to kill all the Goblin spawns. Yeah, time. I think if they watch this and they knew how big of a, a a thing PVP could be instead of what it's not right now, maybe they would change their mind. But at the moment, it just doesn't seem like uh, we're not going to get anywhere PVP wise. And I'm still going to make content for it, but overall, I wouldn't see why anyone would try to learn to PK nowadays or go into the wild and try to make content because it's just it's to the point where it's it's not fun if you don't know what you're doing and it's slightly fun. Yeah over maybe like a bunch of good times instead of all those bad times that are in between those good yeah. times so. i know what you mean well, dude uh, it's not it's not accessible yeah. to players and the, the skill gap is just way too large yeah i feel bad for making guides because they'll go out in the wild after they make their account and yeah it's been a little more active like pure wise lately but not that active <laughs> yeah, not I that mean, active you know, we, we, talk, we spend a lot of time throughout the podcast talking about like the elo system stuff that that could eventually come out and then that would just facilitate making pvp a lot more friendly for new people and for them to get into it yeah you know i'm saying I, I think i think it will eventually come in some capacity I don't yeah know. yeah i feel like that's probably what pvp needs but like i think your i mean your main issue is like obviously people misbehaving uh in the wilderness and stuff like that i mean <laughs> at the end of the day we, we we've talked about it and we obviously have no real solution to no, the current no. problem uh, I mean, like, besides <laughs> not at having all. <laughs> maybe a dedicated, like, person. Hire Mod Minty. I don't know how to code, but I'll be I out there like as a rock, and I'll be looking for people, dude. The, I'll fucking... <laughs> you know, the reports and stuff, but but it's it's not black and white. That's the problem with those yeah. issues. There's a lot of gray areas that no one gives yeah. a flying shit about. Like some sometimes, like, you know, even if you have, like, a person that is really um, reasonable and, like, they'll they'll ban accordingly... At the end of the day, people are always gonna uh, they're, ar they're gonna argue that no, that person didn't deserve to be banned for ragging. Because yeah. like, I almost feel like you need you know, a lawyer. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like yeah. a lawyer yeah, so, for banning yeah. people. It's like, all right, officer, this is what he did. And you need all this shit in order to get anything yeah. done. Like, why? Yeah, it's nice a video game. The, the nice, yeah. The, the nice thing about it though is that Jagex can ban for any reason, and it's their game. Yeah. Like, like, remember, some guy like tried to fucking sue Jagex. For banning, uh, yeah, he didn't uh, get nowhere, did he? 
Yeah, no, he didn't get anywhere because he's a fucking idiot. We're trying to <laughs> yeah, you that meme was amazing, though, wasn't it? On Twitter? Yeah. That fucking meme. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to call yeah. my lawyers. He yeah, has so many days. Yeah. <laughs> like, good luck, dude. And then he, then he he admit that he was botting or some shit. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Like yeah, I was botting or whatever, but like that's not a big deal. It's still unjust. It's like all right. <laughs> man, so man fucking hipsters, dude. Come on, get out of trying to sue video games oh. for being a shitty. Man, why don't you ban me, man? All I did was bot a little. <laughs> <laughs> all I did was break your main code. Get out of here, bro. I I, I just bought it a little. That, that's that's yeah. the fucking. That, that's I love it. Right there. Yeah. Just yeah. a tad, dude. Just a tad. People are Do you not like there. quests, <laughs> mate. Nobody likes quests, man. Yeah, man. Wait, you gotta mean, do them. Thanks to, <laughs> thanks to yeah. Soup's guides, they are super yeah. easy, right, boys? They are. Yeah, you know, with, with those prime rib guides, like you just I the mean, best, you man. Not? Yo, Frame, I told you the first time I saw Soup, right? At what TwitchCon, it was at TwitchCon when I first met everybody. You remember how we held down the um, was it the cannabis or whatever that bar place? And I see him walking up, and I just yell, uh, quest guides, and he just looks at me so disappointed. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Poor I gosh. felt a little bad. We're cool now, but uh, he oh, took yeah. it well. Where's, but he's just, the fun, dude? <laughs> he just... His it's face fun. got sad. He's like... Yeah. Oh, dude, I he, know. He's, he's, he's such a good guy. I like yeah. it. Dude, dude, I, I, I really like yeah. Stefan. Yeah. Dude, what we, what we were doing, though, uh, in the beginning, like... We were all like so excited to make videos that like we wanted to just make videos on anything, and he made one quest guide, and uh, like it got so many views and traction that he was like, "Oh my god, I'm gonna keep doing this." So he kept doing it, and huh. he he wanted to get as many out as possible, and like, yeah, he, he admits yeah, he, that too. Sugar so, Rush man. is on that yeah. Sugar Rush. Yeah, I don't blame so, like, him. He, don't blame he was him. up on two, three guys a day at times. Oh, damn, fucking hell! Yeah. So he Wait, finished he done, the like, whole... all the quests. Yeah. Yeah, of course. Yeah, so so that's so that's why Jesus. he didn't have like the most quality in some of the videos, but like yeah, because it because yeah, yeah, it was, yeah, yeah. It was there's it, no it, way. I think it made him even better. He turned it to a meme, you know. I mean, yeah, yeah. They, they they worked in the beginning, like those like those quest guides, like they still got shit done. It's just there was like little annoying stuff that he just didn't bother to edit out, and like yeah, I, yeah. I, I admit that's like kind of annoying, but at the same time, like it. It still got the job done. Oh yeah. You know what I mean, I mean yeah. for for its time, you know, it got it got yeah. the job. For 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 yeah. its time, for his time it worked yeah. well. But yeah. like what well, now efficiency scape, you do like the littlest thing wrong, you get fucking you get yeah. your What's wrong flash. with people doing that I wear shit? I power amulet 100 combat. I get so many goddamn comments. <laughs> Upgrade your amulet. Shut up, man. It's only 4 Attack like worse. People don't know. People don't know. It's, they just need power. So like, fuck you, you fuck. <laughs> it's so stupid. Okay, I might I be like, guilty of that too, yeah. but like, <laughs> I'm what? so triggered because you have a power amulet. You know, and like what kind of ponytail I'm, having fedora wearing kind of people are out there making fun of people not like fletching right? You know, or something. Yeah. What is wrong with you people? There's so much shit in the world, and you got to comment on people not three tick fishing every time they can. Like, what? No, is dude. Like, I remember uh, a while ago. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I fucking, I made a video for, like, Twitter, because I, I was just runecrafting. I was like, uh, I, I called it feeling sweaty. And, like, I thought I was doing okay. I know I wasn't doing it the best. But um, a, month, a month later, the efficiency Twitter caught hold of it, and they were fucking harassing me. There was, like, 15, 20 people that were just making fun of me nonstop. It was like, you guys, you, you guys are kidding me, right? Like, you're yeah. making fun of me because I didn't rune craft efficiently. <laughs> I, I don't. I, fucking, I, I didn't. I didn't say I'm doing. I, I didn't caption it. I'm doing efficient rune crafting. I said I'm feeling sweaty. So what I was That's doing joke, is, you know? hey, yeah, like I, I'm feeling sweaty. I'm doing rune crafting. I'm enjoying this right now. Like, haha. And they're when like, the joke you're fucking through, bad. Yeah. You're so fucking hey, dude. Bad. In their defense, man, you should just get good and stop being a shitty runescaper. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> get good, dude. Warm. Come on, man. <laughs> You gotta That's, conform to the official problem. <laughs> yeah, dude. Like, if, if I don't fucking take and manipulate fucking rune crafting and sweat my tits off, then yeah, I, I suck at this game. Uh, uh, hey, look, Ollie on early onset arthritis is trending, man. Come yeah, on, man. Yeah. Dude, everyone loves getting arthritis early on. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> yeah, it's it's the, it's the end thing to do. But like, yeah, it sucks. I, I, it's you, you know what, like, dude. <laughs> It's gonna sound like stupid, but I can't think of any other like way to to put it. It kind of feels like they would make fun of people for having a fat dick. You know what I mean? 
Like it's like it's not it's not official. What the fuck, yeah. Framed? <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, let, let me let me get my point across. You know what I mean? We, we might have like, to, we might have to censor this for. Yeah. Okay. Maybe you can censor it if you want. You can cut it out if you want. But what I was trying to say is like, why are you making fun of me for that? Like it, like you're making fun of me for something that's not something that you could really make fun of for not playing the game efficiently. Like, I don't get it. It's like you're making fun of someone. For, hence having a fat dick. It's like it doesn't make sense. <laughs> I'm, I'm not can you say I the do, word? I'm just saying. It's like Ray well, Romano well, saying it. Can you say fat dick again, dude? Is yeah. Uh, what as Ray Romano? It just sounds amazing. Yeah, what? yeah. Fat. Oh. <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> fat dude. dick. What like that? <laughs> Dude, you gotta tell us your uh, high school shower room story, man, because this didn't just appear, bro. Okay, someone got made fun of having a fat dick in high school. Tell us, man. How is it like having a fat dick? Dude, I wouldn't fucking know, to be honest. (laughs) You can dream. Dude, the only thing that happened to me in high school is I got fucking kicked out of school for two days because I drew a picture of uh, a stick figure telling another... No, a stick figure telling another stick figure. And they, they, I, I, I shit you not, because I did it four times, uh, and I put a security camera in one of them. They thought that I was trying to plan a murder. Oh my god! Oh my god! I, like, I am like, and, and like, what, what do I do? Hell? I just sit there and cry. I'm in fucking. I'm 13 or 14 at that point. Yeah. I'm a freshman in high school. Like, like you, you dead ass think some kid that's just sitting there doodling stick figures and display no sign of like any like aggression or whatever is trying to fucking do that. Well, were you yeah, white? But, oh, like, <laughs> were you you're, white you're though? You might have been, you know, it might have all just been inside. No, dude. no, no. Why don't they said? Why don't know the, the reasons? It was that, and because I sleep in class. <laughs> like that was it. And, and dude, they, they made me go to a fucking. Did you go to a private school or something? Because yeah. no, they made me go to a psychologist, and I went. Man, there. This explains a lot now. <laughs> Wow. What no, the dude. fuck? The true yeah, origin dude. story behind Loring. I'm just yeah, I know. <laughs> dude, they made me go to a psychologist, and the guy was like, "Yeah, I don't really understand why you're here." Like after it was all said and done, they asked me like all these like questions, like, "Have you ever been abused?" I was like, "No." Have you ever like done this, this, this? No, no, no. And they're like at the end of it, they're like, "Okay, well, I don't know why you're here." Then. I yeah, wish they like, brought my ass to a psychologist. You know what I would do is when we do like a self grading papers, I just draw huge dicks on their paper. <laughs> See, that Never doesn't got... really help you. That doesn't help you in life. Hey. No, hey. no, it doesn't. But it wasn't my paper. Um, that's. Bro, I... I don't have an excuse. I just drew Yo, dicks okay, a lot. Okay, quick story, man. I was I was the baddest kid. In, in... <laughs> Boy, first you look like I could cheat off year. you and no, no, pass. No, 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 what do you mean? Okay. <laughs> all right, all right. But here's the dealio, bro. On day one of, of freshman year of high school, it wasn't even an official class. It was just like getting to know the school, getting your locker rooms and shit. And I got suspended on that mother freaking day. On that day, it wasn't even class time. Bro, you look dangerous. Oh, oh, oh. And, and the worst part is, is that like it was a text of somebody that didn't even have a number. <clears throat> So I was just in class, you know, we're about to go to our lockers, and it just rang. Like, I, had to I didn't know my phone was on, but I didn't think I would get in trouble, right? Because I'm like, oh, whatever, it's my phone. And then, right. like, some greasy-ass lady teacher, like... like Volunteers. She wasn't even okay. lying. She wasn't even my homeroom teacher. She was just bossing my homeroom teacher around, and she was like, whose phone was that? Like, you know, like, really obnoxiously loud. It's like, if you don't tell me who it is, everyone here stays after school. I'm like... <laughs> sleep over let's go you know? like, okay, hey, yeah, that, was me. Some, that was me you know some teachers man i swear if, yeah, we're, if we're telling yeah, oh high God, school so stories pissed, yeah, in yeah. the uk the equivalent to high school is uh secondary school yeah. it's, it's like when you hit puberty like a teenager and stuff yeah so year seven is the youngest year i, I can't remember how old i was for me like, it was uh, eighth grade freshman year yeah. I, I was probably like 12 years old i was telling my mate last night about this i went around my mates he kept uh enchiladas they were banging <laughs> and uh, there was this girl, right? And there was a trend in school. And this isn't like a me getting in trouble kind of thing. That's uh, funny. You got laid? There, there no. was a trend, kind <laughs> of. That's, that's a pretty oh. cool trend. You got oh, pictures? <laughs> so, uh, oh, never girls, mind. No, no. Never mind. There was like a trend. These girls were wearing these uh, trousers that were super tight. Right, oh, and it right. didn't. Yoga it pants. didn't. It did not matter if they were fucking her- horrendous. If they had no ass, hairy legs. It made, <laughs> it made it look good, right? Like it looked good. And there was this girl. Oh I'm not gonna God. say. What is going on right now? I'm not, I'm not <laughs> gonna say this. I'm not gonna say this girl's name. 
But when I was in school, all I wanted to do was play video games and have fun, right? And uh, I had a woodwork class, and woodwork was two uh, hours. Workshop, right? Right. I was really young, I didn't give a fuck about it. And all I would do for these two hours, and it sounds so fucked up, all I'd do for these two hours was literally dry hump this fucking girl wearing these leggings with this amazing what? fucking ass. She would be there, yeah, I'd just be pretending to be helping her, and she'd be like bent over sticking her ass out, <laughs> and I'd, ha I'd have my full on raging hard cock pushed up against her ass, pretending to help her and uh i remember this one time oh, and i was really fucking <laughs> you young. should this... probably clarify how old you, by the way <laughs> i i was like 12 years old dude. okay there you go because yeah. like we, we all did weird shit when we were 20 year old, old. Uh, i was a substitute oh, teacher oh, that was dude. a twist oh, dude oh, oh, dice. Oh, dice. he's gonna be taking he's gonna be calling you the next he just round. jumps in a so call he goes like oh one time I was pushed up against her and I was like super fucking like I was really young I didn't really know what I was doing I was just doing like <laughs> you, you, know, flow, you know I was going with the fucking flow it felt good why not and like <laughs> so it was happening and all of a sudden I just felt something really weird happen to me oh, and man. I was like oh what the fuck and like you know I felt really sensitive and shit <laughs> So I pulled away from her because I was like, what the fuck's oh going my God, on? You like, came your pants. I came in my fucking pants. Yeah, I blew the biggest fucking <laughs> nut in my fucking box. Oh my God. And <laughs> so I didn't know what had happened. I was really young. Oh like, it never happened to me before. And <laughs> yeah. so I pulled away from the girl, like, naturally, because I was like, oh my God, I'm like really sensitive. Like, what the fuck just happened? And then a second later, the girl shoves her ass into my crotch because obviously I'd stopped doing it and she was enjoying it. Uh, and after that, I just went and sat down. I ran home after school. And I remember <laughs> I just got home, took my trousers off. And I was like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> like, this is disgusting. Oh, my God. My, my boxers were filled, mate. <laughs> what are you uh, talking about? We don't want to know about your okay. boxers being filled, bro. <laughs> they were you, fucking man. leaking. <laughs> fucking so, hell. Like, Okay, it's super so primal, man. Yeah, that was great. That was a great story, but uh, dude, break these nuts on everybody, dude. Watch your ass, bro. Yeah, uh, so, dude, so yeah, wait, wait, can, wait, is I that why say... you were doing that to me at the fucking all? <laughs> <laughs> it just felt good, man. I was going with I, it. I could honestly say that I have came in my pants once in my life. I'm not ashamed of that. At least you were awake. Oh, okay. oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, Holy I, shit. I've, ne I've never had a wet dream, though, which is really strange. Really? Yeah, because yeah, you're wanking on people in public, dude. Of course you're not going to have a wet dream. <laughs> <laughs> Dry hump and feeds. I'm... Damn, dude, dude, it was consensual. She pushed her ass hey. into me. Yeah, we were both enjoying true. ourselves. Wasn't I ain't blaming anything. you, man. Dude, no, let's, we, be, let's be real. The, the internet's over. real sensitive these days. But like, no one yeah, actually man. gives it. No one actually gives a shit, though. You know what I mean? There's people yeah. that are looking for controversy. So, like, you're good, yeah. but like, you gotta clarify you're 12 from the beginning. I, I was yeah, 12 yeah. years old. He was the was, substitute yeah, we were teacher. About high school, <laughs> man. We were talking about high school. No, I know, I know. Yo, Dude, just these days, you gotta yeah, fucking watch days, your yeah. back. I was Caption, about to go into a story meant, after you talked yeah, about like, enchiladas, but put, I can't put the top that. the subtitles in the center of this piece just say, he was 12, by the way, you know? Like, yeah. <laughs> well, just put 12, by the way. <laughs> yeah, yeah I, should have, I should have probably started with that, to be honest. Yeah, yeah. Yo, so, you know that phone thing I was talking uh, about? We, we all know what you're talking about, but yeah, Yo, go ahead. You know the phone thing I was talking about? I got suspended for that, bro. I got suspended. Yeah. It sucked. I literally had a thing on my mark. It says I was suspended. Like, so I went back to my, my house, you know, and, and my mom's like, what are you doing here? I'm like, I got suspended. It's like, what do you mean? Go back Did you nut on I'm somebody? Like, <laughs> Wait, what do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> That's why you should get suspended. You nutting on people. Yeah, you know? like, yo, my, my mom was like, no, you're going back to school. I'm like, I can't. I'm suspended. It's like, what do you mean? It's like, it means I can't go to school. It's like, oh, I busted so a like, fat one today. You know, that's like, it's like, so like, I busted a fat nut. I can't. <laughs> the teacher did not like you. <laughs> yeah, man. I just come back, you know, the the day after, and it was like, yo, I heard you got suspended, man. What you do? It's like, well, you're not gonna believe this, but I you know, killed someone. Rang. Yeah, my phone <laughs> rang. You know, they're like, "Oh shit!" Like, what the hell? It's like, yeah, I know, it's so stupid, man. You could you could have been a badass from day one. You I could've... know, yeah, I was, dude. I was I was known as the badass. You know, they one suspended, bro. Me and like two other people, you know. And I was I was in front of that person that got suspended right after, because yeah. I went to the principal's, you know. Her phone rang oh, too, yeah. so then she was like, "Give me that phone," and then. That person got suspended too. I was like, Damn. Yeah, that, that that woman just needs to get laid. Yeah, man. Yeah, uh, Rakesy, get her, get her. I mean, her hairstyle. <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. I'm sorry, man. That's just a great. I I was gonna yeah. share my 
enchilada story. You started with enchiladas. Anyway, I was about really to jump quick, into really it. Ah, quick, yeah, go for any, it. Any, any any man who would do that too needs to get laid too. So yeah, yeah, so yeah, we're, yeah. We're, we're really establishing our grounds here. Oh my yeah, lord, we're not gonna awesome. call you out for being a feminist, there, yeah, friend. We're good, dude. Not. Anybody, dude. It's, it was, it was, it was We're going to title that shit, though. Frame hates ladies in the All of Us podcast. Frame hates ladies. 12, by the way. You know, like the title yeah. should be 12, by the way. You know? 12. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I was going to. Was... You, won't, you won't believe what Rixy did when he was 12. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, what's your enchilada story, dude? Well, I mean, I, I'm gonna tell it just because I'm gonna tell it, but it's not gonna beat the nothing in my pants story. I'm okay, sorry. Yeah, it's no, just... I don't think anything can. Well, yo, so I was failing Spanish. The only class I've ever failed. So I noted in my pants. Um... <laughs> oh, dude. So I actually got a tutor, and I was trying to study and everything, whatever. And there was this um, bring your own culture food day where you just brought food. And let's just say my teacher wasn't. Uh, the skinniest person. She resembled oh, no. the purple thing from McDonald's, whatever that thing is called. Well, you know, the... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, he's just he's fake. <laughs> Dude, I can... y'all too funny today, man. I can't even. Um, so yeah, she looked like Thanos, and uh, just made me nut in my pants. But no, we brought on food. And my ground makes these bomb ass enchiladas, and I was failing, dude. I had a D in that class. I've never gotten a D in my life. So I bring up enchiladas, and then I just go back to my seat. And since, you know, my teacher, built like Thanos, comes over, takes half the fucking plate, throws it on her plate, and walks off and doesn't touch anything else. I'm like, damn, bitch. No, the whole thing enchiladas, Dude. you can't just take half of it. So I go Dude, over. Yeah, wait, are you telling me that Thanos snapped half of it? <laughs> Shut the fuck up! <laughs> Basically. <laughs> yeah, dude. Her fat little fingers did that, and they were gone. So I go over, I'm like, hey, you just demolished half the planet there, Thanos. Can I get uh, extra credit? Bump my ass up to a B, and I passed. <laughs> What she did? Yeah. So oh, that's how I, I. So because that's Thanos destroyed half your plate, you got a B. That's fucking yeah, solid. Yeah, it's yeah, doesn't. B's halfway to a great grade. You know? And then I nutted in my pants. That's. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh wow. That's amazing. Dude, that's fucking crazy though. That like she actually gave you a B for that. Yeah, I still yeah, remember some it. Teachers, some teachers really like they pretend like food. But she, she had her priority straight. Mm. Yeah, dude, some teachers don't give a fuck. It's not like they're yeah. gonna really check that. Like, oh, you fucking you gave him a B because you gave you enchiladas. Like, no, <laughs> no one gives a shit. Yeah, dude, yeah, everyone, everyone's just trying to fucking get paid. That's it. Damn, yeah. bro. Some wisdom Listen, came from bro, this. All, all you gotta do is not fucking beat the shit out of the kids when they come into the school, and then you're good. That's not I it. mean, like, I had some, you know, like chill teachers. I had some really moral teachers. They won't change nothing they'll just play by the by their rules by the grades so yeah. you gotta know who's who because like the ones that you can kind of fly you can you know take it easy but the ones you know take it seriously you gotta be serious too you know that's how you survive Dude, i i don't know how it works in america but like in the uk if you're fucking stupid you're stupid there's no like getting out of it you know like it's like you have to do it yourself <laughs> yeah, you know? dude, you, either you cheat you know yeah. You can be dumb as fuck here and get and away. cheat. I mean, you can cheat, basically. I mean, Just yeah, become dude. a RuneScape content creator. You'll be fine. Yeah, oh, dude, honestly. Man. Devalue all my go, stuff. man. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, Frame, do you got any uh, nutting in your pants stories you want to share as well for the high school days? Oh, dude. Am, yeah, I, I, am I really much. the only person that's ever came in their pants? Like, I uh, do that uh, sleeping. I probably, I, listen, I probably, yeah, have, sleeping. I probably have, but I don't remember it, so I'll give you that. Like I'll, I'll kind of back you up. I probably you just nut in your pants remember. and don't remember it. There's no way. <laughs> yeah, dude. Maybe, maybe yeah. because it happens so often. That I, I mean, I I ripped my pants before. You know. <laughs> and then Racy <laughs> came behind a nut and right. Because <laughs> you came so hard. <laughs> no, Damn. It was, it was the I got first stuck time on a fence. You know. That'd be a, that's a good <laughs> first time. I would have liked that to be my first time. I was grinding up on my pillow, dude. Fucking lucky man over here. Wait, you was call, it, was it, call it a pillow? You call it a pillow? <laughs> yeah, Wait, we're both in America, no, framed. Okay. We call these no. things pillows, man. No, 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 no. Pillow. What, 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 wait, wait. What, what comes out of cows? What comes out of cows? Juice. Milk. <laughs> no, 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 no. Man, what comes? Well, you got cows? like cow pillows, dude. What do you mean? No, no. Uh, what, what comes out of cows? I just want to hear how you pronounce it. Milk. Ah, oh, you're the oh, no. It's not milk. It's, it's not milk, milk right? It's milk. Yeah, it's fucking milk, dude. There's it's no the same thing. <laughs> no, 
Wait, dude, my, do, do you spell my, it listen, differently or something? Am I no, okay? no, no. Milk. I fucking, listen, my ex girlfriend did this. Why do you think I'm not with her? No, not not yeah. for that. <laughs> I all started. She yeah, nutted. But like milk. Not milk. <laughs> milk. <laughs> milk. It's not milk. Now milk. I'm not invited to the next video. That's what happens yeah, now. <laughs> you're fucking. You're barred from any video. Oh there we. My God. You know what? It correctly. When I'm in your video, man, I'm gonna scream milk when something really good's happening. So it's got to be and, in the and video. I'm, and I'm gonna fucking. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like the elk part is just gonna be gone. It's gonna be like, mm. you'll, you'll be like Meh. Is it so? It's milk then, or that, it's yes, milk. milk. Like how the fuck? What else would you say that word? It's not. Okay, I'm just we're, we're gonna go ahead. Listen, malak. Say ilk. Don't eat, don't don't you fucking dare. Elk. <laughs> All right, thank I you for having me on the I podcast. Uh, I will see you later. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he fucking dude. left, dude. Oh, man. Oh, that's funny. Uh, yeah, it's, that's, it's, okay. it's, it's there, okay. there is no way in hell that it is milk. You have to, you have to, you just have milk. to. Mike. Right. Oh, man. Yeah, it's all good, though. I don't really care. So I don't even drink milk. So I, I get matter. roasted all the time for my pronunciation, okay? So whatever. Uh, of, of what, though? Like, very, like, very, like. Oh, it'll that's, it'll that's sound like R E V I. They keep saying, they keep typing R E V I. Are they are, are they making fun of you because like you have an accent though? I don't know. Like that's, I, that's, I don't think I have listen, an accent. Listen, <laughs> it, 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 it's that's a different story. That's just kind of wrong. But like, yeah, it, it, it is. Oh, wrong. it's because I'm white. I can't say milk, but he can say <laughs> milk because he's Asian. You fucking racist no, ghost. <laughs> no, no. Here's the thing. I am a fob though, but yeah. <laughs> Dude, talking about getting slammed you know. for pronunciation, I think you know. man. I think I, I you know how to pronounce it. My every God. video God. I upload, I get hammered for how I say stuff. Same, same, yeah, no. same. Especially, no, I especially it. the. I, or, dude, like, I, I've heard it from so many different people though. Like, they, they think the way you talk is funny when, like, you say, yeah. like, yeah. dude, like, I'm gonna go to my father's house. Like, that's what I hear. <laughs> Like, well, like, how do you, you? All right, I say it, father. Oh my okay. God, why? That sounds like you're uh, <laughs> German. How do you say? How do you say, it? father? Father. Father. <laughs> father. 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 I, oh, okay. dude, I don't. I don't give a shit. I don't give all a right. crap. Like, yeah, you know what? That, that's where you're from. Uh, where, where, oh, where so he from? can uh, say it, but I can't I'm say like, milk, dude. This is yeah, some yeah, bullshit. Okay. Uh, hey, it's I have not a where I'm from. It's not where I'm from. Where I'm from, we heavily pronounce our R's, but the whole F thing. Is I just didn't pay any attention when I was in primary school. Like that's why it comes out. Yeah, yeah, you're too you're too busy coming in women's pants. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't be able to pay attention either, man. Yeah. It's fair. It was yeah. difficult to concentrate, man. They were wearing like these tight ass <laughs> leggings and shit. Like, what was I supposed to do? Yeah, you're, you're, right. You're, you're, right. Right. you're right, Racy, you're right. But no, I remember the yeah. lesson in primary school where the teacher was like F and then th <laughs> where you you put your tongue to like the, the roof of your mouth and say Th. But it takes so much more effort to say father than what it does to say. Fa. Holy shit! Both of those are wrong. Both no, of those no, are no, fucking no. wrong, dude. What do you mean? They were both not even close, dude. Oh my God. <laughs> father, not father. I get it. I get it. Rexy, can, can you say yeah? Okay. What were you gonna say? That, that was it. I was just trying to say words that begin with F. Oh, okay. Fuck. You say that one well. <laughs> can you get rid of your accent? Is that possible for you? I mean, basically, can you speak American? Try it. Try, try, try to get rid of your accent. The British do it all the time for TV. Try to get rid of it. Just become American for a second. Uh, hello, American. Yeah. Good day. My name is Tom. Nope. Oh, I can. I felt it. It's the rustiness in his voice, dude. It just. I I can speak proper, but there's a twang. A twang, dude. Yeah, it's the the jargon, man. You got the jargon. Yo, just like. Have you guys seen a film called Hot Fuzz? Any oh yeah, I love it. Yeah. I, I know okay. it. It, it. It's with that one Sean guy, right? Yeah, yeah. You, you need to watch it. And like the where that was recorded is literally like thirty minute drive from where I live. Dude, you, you gotta know? take some yeah. selfies. I'd love to see that shit. That's sick. Yeah, yeah. I, it's a really nice uh, little village, man. It's called Wells. <laughs> Wells Cathedral. There's a massive cathedral school there and stuff. It's it's beautiful. It's really cathedral nice. But I live real close to that. That's it's sick. like there's like princes and princesses that go there. Do you know what I mean? Like people that yeah. go there got a lot of money. To like send the low key there. prince and princesses of the UK. Dude, you need to grind oh, up on awesome. some of that royal ass, dude. Get a oh, royal yeah. nut going my, on. Dude, my, my brother, my brother was the caretaker there for years, and wow. he, you know, these girls are girls that have just been going like through education their entire life. They never had like interaction with guys, 
and he told me this story about how he was like mowing the grass outside of their um their rooms and there was just one of them was just stood there in the window butt fucking naked just looking at him and saying <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh and he was just there mowing the same patch for like 10 <laughs> minutes just looking oh up oh my him. gosh <laughs> <laughs> the fuck he yeah. probably get he probably get in <laughs> trouble for that yeah shit, yeah man. I mean, Probably. like, yeah. and, and to clarify, these girls were of age, okay? Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Oh my gosh, yeah. We kind not of assume, 12, not twelve. We, we, we kind of assumed there, so yeah. I don't know. Frames our H our HR guy, yeah, dude. I'm paranoid yeah. now, dude. <laughs> Maybe being a little nefarious here, so. Uh, Ooh, yeah. big word there. It's confusing, man. You know, human relationships are confusing. Yeah, you got to issue a public apology, okay? That no yeah. one actually is going to care about. I'm sorry for coming in my pants at 12 years old. Yeah. We're going to have to see a tweet, and we're all going to have to retweet it, my man. Fuck it, it's fine. That's all right. And you have to add old school RuneScape in there, too. You're going to have to have a 45 minute uh, State of the Union address on your YouTube. It was just, I was telling the story to my It felt good at the time. Because obviously, like, this is a friend that I knew him all the way through school, and he knew the girl as well, and it was fucking hilarious. We both both knew it. Like, it was just, it was funny as fuck. Yeah. I got, I got, I got so many stupid stories. Like listen, that. The, yeah. the, the second that this, how many times uh, have you this, nutted on somebody, dude? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I got so many nutting on people's stories. It was fifth grade. Her name was Veronica. One of many. <laughs> yeah. One of many. It was college, community college. Like what the right. fuck, dude? I, I, no, I got, I got a banger of a story. If you guys want to hear it, if you guys are a banger, story time, man. I'm Let's down for a banger. Time. All right. So, um, I do, I do have to go. Yeah. I do have to go after that though. Okay, yeah. that, that's fine. This will be the last story. So I have told this before. I told this years ago when I was streaming. And um, I was like 19, 20 years old. I was really into bodybuilding at the time. And I literally, five days a week, I would just gym and eat super healthy. I had a girlfriend that was like long distance and I'd drive down to see her, right? And uh, on the weekends, I'd eat complete shit. Like fucking, you know, as much food as I could cram into my body, mm-hmm. I'd fucking eat. And we went to like this house party and they were having a, uh, a barbecue and the girl that hosted it cooked this chicken and i'm fucking sure of it she did not cook it right it was raw, <laughs> right i'm absolutely sure it's but my raw. my, raw. my yeah. fucking what's the word gluttonous ass just you know i just shoved it in my <laughs> fucking mouth that. and um we were there and all of a sudden my stomach started to like fucking rumble like something rotten and uh i said to my girlfriend i was like look i'm gonna head back to the house i was like i feel fucking sick because we weren't, we weren't at that point where we were like, you know, I need to go take a massive shit. I was just like, <laughs> I feel sick. I'm going to leave. And uh, start walking back and like, it's all hills and stuff. Massive fucking hills. I'm walking up the hill and it's just getting progressively worse. Next thing I know, I hear, wait up. And I look around and she's there and she's like running after oh, me. Oh no. And we start walking up the hill. And then a second later, some people from the party come running up the hill towards us. And we're like, we didn't get to say goodbye. And I'm stood there, like, fucking, you know, standing <laughs> on either foot, like, tiptoeing. Like, I'm about to shit my pants. And I'm like, look, I'm really sorry, oh, guys. Boy. I was like, I need to go. I feel really fucking ill. <laughs> and uh, so I started walking. And this is, like, through a massive city, like a busy city. There's people fucking everywhere, right? Oh, boy. And this is when I was, like, 19, 20 years old. And I swear on my fucking life, I just started walking and I just couldn't control it. I couldn't oh control God. it, dude. It's never happened in my life. All of a sudden, I just felt my boxers, they just filled. Like, they literally the way you explain things way. makes Why me fucking sad, this? dude. I, it's not with dude, this? Dude, dude, it's not I'm about to go dude. eat, mate. Oh. They, fucking, they fucking filled. Right, Absolutely. Fuck. Like, all the way around the front and everything. It was disgusting. Come, the yeah. way you explain and, and there, shitting and, like, and coming in your pants is the worst. You know yeah. that? I'm, I'm a deer in headlights. Like, oh I my can god, relate. all these people must see. I, it's relatable. I have a lot of those, but I'm not gonna say here. But uh, so <laughs> I continued walking and I got to like a part where there's like a load of terrace houses and stuff. I went into somebody's back garden, right? <laughs> oh my took, god! Took my boxers off. Took my fucking I'm my like every. Off. I was just there, butt fucking naked. With my boxers filled with like diary, and I just fucking threw them. <laughs> oh come on! And the worst, the worst thing about it was I walked to the house where me and my girlfriend were staying, and she was at the door opening it up, and she was like, "Where, where did you go? How did I get here before you?" <laughs> and I was like, oh, I, "I was like, I was sick in the alleyway. I was really fucking." <laughs> She knew, a hundred percent. She knew because she went to the fucking shop to get some 
in quote sickness tablets and came back with diarrhea tablets. I probably stank as shit, dude. I'm not even joking. Dude. Oh, that was nice of her, though. She was, yeah. that was like, nice. That's a keeper. It, it was yeah, not, it that was is a, nice. That's a keeper right there. That is a Mate. Keeper. It was, it was, it was honestly one of the most embarrassing moments of my life. Hey, it was it. funny, man. I enjoyed that. It was a the good way one. you describe, though, your pants and your boxers feeling has got to be some of the worst shit I've ever heard in my life, Yo, dude. My front breeches filled with shit. So you, I came in her, like, fuck, man. You need to write dude, it, shitty novels. You know that? Yo, like, that's why it makes these videos are so good, because you can describe it. It's so, so Such a fucking like, like the worst the way, way. The best way to explain it is like imagine oh, a balloon fuck. is inflating within your boxers. <laughs> That's what it's oh like. yo, look, hey, Rexy, I've I've many occasions have had to do something similar. It's really that's why it's so funny to me because like I, it hits me right at home. So apparently everyone's just shit their pants a lot. I, I don't I, fit know, in it's, that it's, well. It's because I used to run all the time, so I would go out like you know like. Oh yeah, you just I gotta take a shit. Let me go on a run real quick and just jiggle I mean, it no, out of it. I'm like just... three miles nowhere, and then I have to you know, and it hurts. Like what do you do? You you you're, there's nowhere to go. You got like some random trees. I don't know. Like, Yo, whatever. frame comes on for one fucking podcast. I gotta hear about Rakesy nutting and shitting. All right, what have you done, man? Yeah, what have you done, frame? Yeah. Right. Anyways, let's let's wrap it up because right. friends a busy man. He's got he's got people yeah. to see, business yeah. meetings. Well. Thanks for coming yeah. in, man. Yeah. It was great. Yeah, thanks a lot for coming on, friends. Where can thank, people thank find you? Thank you for you? having me. What are your uh, social medias, my friends? YouTube.com <laughs> slash SparkMac. Stop the deck. <laughs> <laughs> there we go, Good dude. YouTube you know, up, and up and coming content creator. You know, you'll find him on YouTube. Yeah. But thank you guys and for having me. I appreciate it. Hey, no worries, man. Yeah, thanks no for coming on, dude. Very memorable. Awesome. I will always remember yeah. this. For Hopefully people enjoy this one. <laughs>